Hi, hello, Nutty here. <laughs> Sorry, I ended up uh, needing to do a couple things uh, before things started, so I'm a little bit running behind right now, but it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> uh, let's see. Apparently, there's an error. Hmm, one second. Now, this is going to be a problem, isn't it? Uh, let's check here. Hmm. Does that work? I don't know, honestly. Apparently there's something going on with the stream, but I don't know what it is exactly. Huh. What is it? <laughs> and I was all here being like, oh, I wanted to show you guys new things that I like kind of figured out how to do. But then this happens. This is amazing. Oh, wait, it's fine now. I can't tell. <laughs> it says it's fine. Two seconds ago, it said it was bad. I, I don't know. I don't know anymore. Uh, da, 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 da. Hello, what the heck? I can hear things over here, but apparently can't hear things from over there. That that is, that is something. I don't, I, I, but I, this is amazing. Great. This is amazing. Uh, what, uh, what, quick, uh, quick second. Um, mm hmm, mm hmm. I have no idea what's going on. This is amazing. Okay, great. Well, I accidentally did a thing. Sorry. Oh, there we go. I guess it's fine. I can't hear myself on the stream, and I can't tell if that's because my like browser's all messed up or something. Uh, this is amazing. Okay. Hmm. Let me quickly check something. Let me go into my settings and see if that's what's going on here. Hmm. Okay. Is it working now? Hello. Hi. Hello. Ooh. Ooh. Hi. Hey. Hello. I'm trying to figure out how things are working. I can't tell. Can you guys hear me? Can you hear me? Can somebody just say if they can hear me? Because I honestly have no freaking idea what's going on. <laughs> this is great. Also, my chat apparently isn't working. Huh. That's another thing. I can see. I can see you. Hello, mock. But I can't. See. You're apparently not on screen. Uh. Uh. One second. <laughs> uh. I, bah, 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 bah. Okay. Because of all, okay. That's because of that. That's because of that. Bah, 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 bah. Why isn't my chat working? <laughs> That's all well and good. Stream is good. This is good. That's working. Blah, 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 blah. But apparently, this isn't. <laughs> yeah, what's going on? Why? Okay, what? Um, let's see. Hmm. Wait, let's see. There we go. Oh, hello! Hi! Hello, Shockwave. Good. Can you guys hear me? I just want to make sure, because I can't hear myself. Because <laughs> I don't care if I can't hear myself. As long as you guys can hear me, all is well and good. It's just... Mm. I'm worried. Okay, good! Woo! <laughs> Thank you, Shockwave. 
<laughs> okay. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's go to the scene that I was going to do before, because this is an art stream. I should probably be trying to figure out how to do things. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay. For some reason, chat is working, so I guess we don't have chat. <laughs> I don't know why that is. Add exist existing. I don't... Ah, whatever. Whatever. Okay. Apparently, we just don't have chat. Okay, let's go down to the other thing. Because I did things. I, I was trying to be smart and stuff, and then stuff went wrong. But it's fine. Uh, let's go over to the art thing. Because we're supposed to learn how to do art stuff. I already did a thing. Look, you can see my hand. I, you can see my hand. Oh, my God. Also, the freaking um stream is so laggy. Oh, my God. Okay. Whatever. It's fine. <laughs> All right. So. I did, I, I, uh, did a thing. This was from my, my old drawing of myself that I did. Second, let me just quickly Google that. This, this is from an old drawing of myself. Where is it? I'm sorry. <laughs> I sound working. Apparently. There we go. Yeah, I had, I had an old, uh, two old, uh, drawings of mine. And I just kind of redrew it. Because, um, I, I, if you already made the wheel... Don't break it. I, whatever the, the saying is, I can't remember. <laughs> but yeah, I did a thing. I already did myself. Look, look, look at my pretty little anime face. Woo. Anyways, but I am either going to be doing one of two things today. So we can do just trying to figure out how to put line on paper. Or we could uh, finish a drawing that I already had already prepared before stream started, which I might need to fix the proportions on but it's fine so we have one of two options uh this one i was gonna try making a few outfits because you know body and all we're gonna make a couple outfits on this one or try drawing this i don't know if if i'm ready for this this, this, this is not gonna go very well i'm used to my tablet i i'm, I'm not used to this <laughs> okay i should probably get my pen though okay oh. also if you can hear my dog in the background. No, you don't. <laughs> my dog's just kind of going back and forth. You know what? I'm just going to put her up on the thing. One sec. I can't tell if, like, she hurt her back or something. She's an old dog, so she, she could have thrown her back out. Who knows? But, um, yeah. We're going to take... Whoop. One second. Mic troubles. Oop. I don't want to touch the mic to mic just because I, I don't like the sound it makes when I touch it. Yeah. Mics are not supposed to be touched. Anyways. But. I do have a couple thingies I did. So let's see if I can show them. Other than my hand. Which, look, I made that I made my hand. Look, look at my little hand. Woo. You can tell I painted my nails for this. <laughs> um, But I also did a couple things so let's see if i could do it so when i when i when i try to be funny like if i make a joke that isn't actually all that funny and whatever one second Ooh, there's like ah i'm learning things there's stuff on the keyboard that i can press okay <laughs> eh, where where eh, there we go i wanted to see something so yeah, I want. To. Okay, so I am. I'm not losing my mind. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So other than this, oh, he's coming. Mouse, where art thou, mouse? Yeah. There, there I am. Uh -huh. Ha ha. That's what those do. But if I'm trying to make a funny joke and I'm not actually that funny, but to kind of do the punchline, I can do a thing. Let's see if I can do it. If it'll let me. Who knows? Is it going to let me? Oh, is it shift? Yes, it is. Okay. Hello! I can make myself big again. Hi. Hello. Am I too close? Yeah. I. This is the first time I had a tablet. 
So I am so excited. When the thing came in my door, the um, I was at school. And so I wasn't here to get it when it came up. And it was raining the exact same day. So I was like texting my mom, like, please check the door. Please check the door. Please check the door. Please check the door. Because <laughs> I don't want it to get like ruined by the, like the big rainstorm we had. I hated it so much. The one day I wasn't at home, it came in. It was horrible. But my dad's fine. Got it. Said, thankfully. <laughs> but. So, I'm going to try figuring out how to use it. <laughs> I've only ever had an iPad tablet, which I did most of my drawings, including my beautiful self on the, on the screen right now. But, um, so this is the first time I've been using a tablet. <laughs> I had a Huion tablet, you know, like the ones that don't have screens. Um, but I couldn't figure out how to use it. Like, I tried for so long. There's such a learning curve when you can't see the screen and you kind of have to, like, kind of have a weird hand-eye coordination thing with the, um with the screen and a different screen than you're drawing at. It's weird, but I did it, so it's fine. Okay. Okay, so let's do a thing. I also never used Krita before. So this is just gonna go very well. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay. But if you are trying to get a tablet, one of two things is that if you're, you know, you new to art stuff and tablets and all that when it comes to like computer art, I would suggest not going with a display tablet because they can be a little more expensive. Even though I couldn't figure out how to use the uh, pen tablet, but that's mostly because I didn't have time to practice that much. I would consider if you want to get a tablet for like your computer to draw with, I would go with like the other tablet. The, the um, what are those things called? I can't remember. But let's. Uh, it's a one without a thing. Da, 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 da. Here we go. Let, let, da, 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 ba, da, da, ba, da. I can't figure out how to do things. This is fun. Do that. Okay. I don't know how to do anything, honestly. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Yes. And boop. Okay, one sec. I think it's bold. Change window size. Nope, that's not it. This one. What the heck? I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Go with that. Okay. That doesn't work either. That's great. Okay. Well, I tried getting a picture. The picture does not want to show up on screen. It, it's uh, it's a sad day for everybody. Um. However, I want to make sure things are working. Okay, it is working. Whatever. I'm just I'm just I'm just paranoid. Okay. Whatever. But yeah, it's a it's a tablet that has no screen on it but it still does draw and has like pen pressure and you have a pen and everything i have one again i just didn't have enough time to actually use it to be able to practice how to use a stupid thing um but it's fine it's fine whatever so we're gonna try figuring out how to use this one today <laughs> i literally got it yesterday i think did i get it yesterday yeah i did it was the day before yeah it doesn't matter regardless but i did get my sketches in here and everything once i oh my god it's not working that's fine <laughs> nope that's still not working down to krita please uh, this is great things aren't working properly i can i want to quickly things are gonna mess gonna be messed up for a second one second it's just, I have my mouse on the wrong, uh, thing. One sec. Is it on three or is it two? It's two. Okay, good. Alrighty, there we go. Let's save that. Boop. Boop. And boop. Okay, now we're good. Now it's working. Yay. Finally, I can actually do things. <laughs> See what I mean? I have no idea what I'm doing. It's fine. It's great. Everything's fine. 
we're gonna open up chat again because I can't see it on the screen. There we go. Yeah, like there's a there's a tablet that doesn't have a screen on it. Basically, it's just a black a black uh, thing, the black little mat thing. I don't know how to explain it. It's not a mat. It's not like rubbery. It's like a plasticky thing that has like a pen, like the one I have on my my screen right now, but it just doesn't have a screen on it. Just the ones with the screen are a lot more expensive. But since I do art on the regular, I I was like, you know what? And I also have a job, so. I have grown-up money. You cannot trust me with grown-up money. This was very much a two-in-the-morning buy thing. <laughs> I was not in the right state of mind, but I still love it, so it's fine. <laughs> so, let's see if I can figure out how to use it. Why am I in red? I'm I'm apparently on red. Why do I have... Oh, hello. There we go. Why do I have, like, red? Apparently, this is not working. Don't you love it when things don't work? This is great. <laughs> I can't control Z anything. Ah, no. Are you kidding me right now? I can't control Z things. Ah, dang it. What was I going to say? It's not working. I'm going to do... Okay. Boop. Boop. Calibration mode. Boop. 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 Okay. Shortcuts. That it is correct. My shortcuts are shortcutting. I just don't know things. Oh, I've been doing art. Um, well, there's two answers to this. How long I've been, been doing art in general since I was like two. How much I've been doing art like consistently. Like I actually want to do art stuff. I think, uh, uh, fifth, I think it was like fifth grade, so a couple years now. It's, it's been like a decade. <laughs> oh, God. I'm getting old. I'm not even that old. I'm still Gen Z. But, okay. Yeah, I've been doing art for a long time. I kind of had a point where I was just kind of not doing stuff for that long. Are you kidding me? It's still not working. Oh, this is great. Hmm. This is weird. The shortcuts aren't shortcutting. It's, it's very weird. I literally tested this out, like, yesterday for so long, and it's still not... This is great. But whatever. But yeah, I've been doing it for a while. I'm currently in uh, school for animation, which is why you see my beautiful little self just animating in the corner here. But, um... But yeah. Specifically for, like, 2D animation, but I am I, I I could I could do both. Well, not really both, but I I I can somewhat do it. It's fine. Come on. Huh. I can't do the control Z on my actual tablet, but I can use it on my keyboard. That's weird. The tablet has like these little buttons on the side that can actually do things and it's not working. Which is weird. I checked this every like everything yesterday, and it's still not working. Hmm. This is weird. Also, this brush is way too big <laughs> for line art. <laughs> oh, but does anyone recognize him? Hopefully you do, otherwise it's not fun. <laughs> okay, I need to lower this stupid opacity. Not opacity. The brush size. Zoom in. <laughs> This is way too small. <laughs> Wait, put this up. No, that's good enough. That's fine. But have you guys done art? Hopefully you have, because, you know, you're still watching me right now, so. <laughs> yeah. I really should put music on here, but I still haven't figured out how to do that without, like, a Spotify, and I don't have a Spotify. <laughs> I should probably do a Spotify. <laughs> Everyone was doing the whole what a Spotify rap thing, and um, it 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 didn't. I, I couldn't participate in the rap, even though mine would probably be like very chaotic. I listen to literally everything and anything. Oh, anime character. Well, he is an anime character, so it does make sense. But it if if you know VTubers, whoop. 
This is Shoto. And do I have a picture of Shoto? I wonder if I do. Hmm. I have to check. I could have sworn I did, though. Shoto. Where are you, Shoto? Do I have you? I do not. Huh. That's weird. I could have sworn I had a picture of Shoto on here. Because I used it as reference for the little cheapy version of him. Mm, where art thou, Shoto? Here, oh, right, here's his reference. So uh, let's go with this. No, we can go over here. <laughs> nope. So over here at open, yes. Or import? Is it import? No, it's not. There we go. Is this man? Oh my god, this is so pixely. This is so weird. But this man. This man is a VTuber. His name is Shoto. On uh, Twitter, he has an X instead of a zero. But um, he's a really funny dude. I, I watch his streams like constantly. I haven't it's in a while though. But it's this man. Even though this is so pix this is so pixely. <laughs> I don't know why it's so pixely. This is <laughs> But this man is this man. <laughs> I, I just made him little, little chibi. But um, but yeah, I've been uh. If you watch any of the other shorts that I do on my channel, I I've um done a couple of YouTubers. Most of them are men. I don't know what it is. I just watch more male YouTubers than anything else. But uh, here we go. Okay, I'm gonna move my mic so I don't accidentally hit it with my pen over and over again because that would not make a very pleasant noise. Okay. <laughs> But I decided I didn't want to sketch on here just because I don't like sketching, I guess. No, it's fine. I just noticed I was think. But I've had the same problem. I went to an art school for like how like how many years? It's middle it was a middle school and high school thing. And it was an art school, and I was there specifically for art stuff. And people were like, oh my god, you should go to an art college, and blah blah blah. And I did get a scholarship to one. But, um, I then transferred some to somewhere else. But, um... Then after that, for some reason, I was so busy with, like, unrelated classes, because, you know, in college, um... Regardless of what your major is, usually you have other, like, academic classes and whatever. So I have, like, psychology, math, all that stupid stuff. But, um, and so I wasn't able to, like, actually draw for myself for a while. And I did it, like, so often during, like, middle and high school that I didn't expect that things would go so awry so quickly. So a lot of my art is very, um, bad recently. <laughs> so I completely and utterly understand learning, uh, the digital art stuff again. Though I do have a, eh, I do have a couple of little drawing overall tutorial videos i think i should do more like digital art specific ones thank you for the idea <laughs> but yeah thankfully i think that like digital art is a little bit easier to understand especially since there's a lot of stuff in digital art that you can't do in traditional art stuff like there's no blending layers and all of that stuff there's no control z if you mess up you mess up and that's it and hopefully you weren't doing anything in like sharpie or paint or something because that's not coming off <laughs> I don't like painting. I hate painting so much. Should I know? Hey, that's good enough. It's fine. But yeah, so most of my art is on my tablet because that's just something I know more than uh than literally anything else. <laughs> and I usually draw more 2D. So a lot of my art is very flat looking because I do a lot of 3D animation. Or 3D. 2D animation. And 2D animation has to be very simplistic and very flat. So a lot of my shading skills have not developed. They're they're non-existent. So I have to learn how to do that again. <laughs> Especially if I actually do want to transfer to a full four-year college for animation stuff. Um I kinda I kinda need to know how to do that. 
Because, <laughs> you know, art colleges usually want to know if you actually know how to do art before they are like, You, you, you don't know how to do art. You shall not go to art college. Um, but, yeah. So, I'm trying to get back into it. And a lot of these drawings are just fun little things. Like this one. This one's just... This one's just gonna be me just putting outfits on myself. <laughs> This one is actually me trying to figure out how to use the brushes, because there are so many brushes. Um, there are so many brushes. Let me see if I can show you. Wait, nope, that's not working. Ah. I forget how to show you. Hmm? Nope, that's not it. It is this one. There we go. Yeah, there's so many brushes. You can see here. There are so many stupid brushes in this program. It is a little bit insane. This is just a sketch brush. Sketch yeah. brushes. If I go to like all, it's like, there are so many brushes. <laughs> I don't know how to deal with all these. What do I do with these? When do I need a, like a weird glitter brush thing? Is this a glitter brush? Yeah, it is. Look at that. Yeah. When do I need that? <laughs> I've been trying to find, like, a good sketch brush, but I have not been able to find, like, a good, good one. I wish I could put my Procreate brushes in here, because... I... <laughs> uh, where is my... <laughs> There's a sketch. There it is. But yeah, it, it's, it's, uh, it, it's not fun. It's, it's very much not fun to try learning things instead of do things from scratch. Thankfully, this is somewhat similar to a lot of, like, computer programs, so a lot of them seem to have, like, the same sort of... Thing. If you know one of them, you most likely know them all, for the most part. Um, and this one's free, so it was just it was just the one I picked. I know that um, if uh, uh bah, bah, bah. yeah, I know that is a lot of things. It's so dumb, but <laughs> um, but yeah, but I did pick Krita because one, it's free and um, I'm cheap, but also like. I've seen a lot of other people use it and stuff. This is so dumb. I've seen a lot of people use it. Like, uh, da, 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 what's that dude's name? It's not Sam Desart. I don't think he uses Krita. Uh, who is it? Oh my god, it's one of those big art YouTubers. It's not Jazza. Jazza doesn't do, like, that stuff. He does whatever. Uh, who is he? Oh my god, I can't remember his name. Ah, uh, he has a he has a little dog, a, a, Shiba, a Shiba Inu. What's his, what's his name? Oh my god. Oh my god. This entire stream is just me getting sidetracked. <laughs> it's fine. Oh my god, what's his name? YouTuber. He, I love all of his art. Oh my god. Right, what's his name? What's his name? What's his name? No, that's not him. A lot of his... I feel like a lot of his audience are, like, kids. I... Ah! Why can I? Why? Why is this so hard? <laughs> ah! I want. I watched a lot of his videos when I was younger, and I remember him getting Krita. And then I was like, from this day onward, I'm going to go and find where where to download Krita once I have an actual computer, and I have a computer now, so I can do it. Where the heck is it? Oh my god! Ross Draws! That's his name, guy! <laughs> Ross Draws. I knew it started with an R. <laughs> but yeah, he has Krita. And so I just kind of binged his videos on how to use it, kind of, even though I don't think he really has a video like specifically on how to do Krita's things. But um, watching a lot of his videos, I was try I, I kind of figured out how to do things. Like, for the longest time, I couldn't find where the eraser button is. I was, like, looking here. I was going into, like, the the, the window docks and the, the all these little screens. You can't see the screens. But there's a lot of stuff up here. I was trying to figure out where the freaking... It's it's here. It's this thing. This is, this is, this is the eraser. And th this is a good and bad thing. Like, it's an eraser. But, one... Sometimes you forget you have it on, and then you're like, what the heck did I just do? Why? Why is everything erasing? Um, but it's because you have this option on. And whatever brush that you're currently using will immediately go into an eraser brush instead. Which is good for some things, but bad for others. I like having, like, a dedicated 
brush for the eraser rather than just using whatever brush I have on me because sometimes I might be doing hair and I have a weird brush and I don't want like weird hair strand things coming out but whatever <laughs> whatever I guess I, I just have to suffer I, I just have to suffer this is great uh, uh oh yeah I also have other effects I just now realized I have other effect things that I can do one sec so there's one where I'm not do I don't know how to do things so there's there's the math I don't know what I'm doing this is me whenever I'm in math class except it's more gibberishy rather than actual numbers <laughs> Once I started using freaking letters, I was just, I'm done. I can't, I can't anymore. I'm going to art. Art is, nope, no math. No math. <laughs> and then there's one whenever I see a Genshin character that I like. A.K. Risley. <laughs> but yeah. Woo. I have effects and stuff. I figured out how to kind of use OBS somewhat. <laughs> uh, whoop. And I also have this. Whoop. Did not mean to do that. <laughs> I accidentally went to I went into the void. No? Okay. We're fine. We're good. We're good again. We're fine. We're good. Uh, let's see. So next thing. What am I doing again? This right. I'm doing I'm doing him. Well, no, no, I'm not no, I'm not no, I'm not doing him. <laughs> no, he's not I'm not doing it. I'm drawing him. Okay. Anyways, oh my god. I need to figure out what's going on with this thing. Hmm. This is weird. <laughs> Where is it? I want to figure out what's going on with the freaking tablet. This is so weird. Um... Uh... Hmm. Wanna read? Hmm. This is so weird. <laughs> hmm. This is. So weird. Whatever. Uh, ba, ba, boom, boom, boom. Why the heck did I just see that now? Be right back. Yeah. Okay. Anyways. <laughs> I really need to keep an eye on chat because I miss things so often. Okay. There we go. So maybe that works better. I need to... I, I need to be able to use my freaking buttons. This is ridiculous. It's fine. Whatever. Gonna do stuff. What was I talking about before, though? Oh. I'm doing line art because, one, I need to figure out how the pressure of the pen works because I need to know whether or not I need I need to change the, like, pressure because uh, pen pressure is basically when um the pen, uh depending on how hard that you are... Uh, drawing on the screen it will change the the size so this is like me being very light and then it goes not anywhere what <laughs> does this not have pen pressure on this on the specific it should have wait one second why is it not working it should hmm. this is weird is it this? It's not. The pen pressure isn't working. This is weird. Hmm. One sec. Where? Oh. Going back to this. Let's see. Hmm. Um. Is this working? What if this works? No. No. Nothing on the on the tablet is working. This is weird. I haven't ever seen. I, I literally went into this but yesterday to figure it out and it's not working. This is so weird. Hmm. Well, first off, I need to I don't want to erase all this. This is really bad. Eh, eh, there we go. Boop. 
Okay, this is weird. This is weird. Nothing is working. Hmm. <laughs> this is weird. Because it's automatically just going to the hardest setting, which is not supposed to happen. Huh. Let me check something. Let me quickly do this instead. I'm gonna try turning it on and on again. When in doubt, turn off and on again. <laughs> okay, let's see. No, still nothing. Huh. Hmm. This is so weird. Send us play. Right now it's kind of dress. Yeah, 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 yada, yada. Huh. <laughs> this is so weird. Also, why isn't the chat working? <laughs> Uh, why isn't anything working, honestly? Uh, yesterday was for nothing, apparently, because nothing's working! Ah! Mm hmm. A group of images sizing, right? Unstable network. Unstable network. Wait a second. Should be better now, I think. In a second. Uh -huh. Great. I literally prepared for the stream and did all this, made sure all there's no scuff, and apparently there's just scuff. It's great. Okay. Great. Amazing. Ugh. Okay. Because the pen faster isn't working. Let me see if it's because there's something going on. Yeah. Because I don't think there's anything going on with the actual um, Krita. I think there's something going on with the actual tablet. Configure Krita. Yes. Let's see. Tablet settings. Let me mess with the pressure to see if that's the problem. <laughs> Let's see if that's nope I'm in the wrong layer. Wait, what? Am I on a weird? Okay, what's going on? Oh, there it is. Yeah, it's an overlay now. Okay, I need to go back to the normal. There we go. So I wonder... This is so weird. Hmm. This is why this is just... This is why the stream is just called, I got a new tablet. I don't know how to freaking use it. Because apparently I thought I figured it out, but apparently I didn't. This is, this is amazing. This is, this is, this is great. This is amazing. Okay. Let me go back here. Let's figure this stupid thing out. Ah, uh, this is great. This is amazing. <laughs> this is great. It is working, but apparently it isn't. Mm. No, no, no. 
if you see me just going randomly here and it doesn't seem like I'm drawing anything, it's because I'm in the settings. Uh, cursor? There's no... We'll go with cursor. That. Yeah, that's better. So I can see myself here. Okay. I don't know what's going on, though. That's really weird. Let me see something. <clears throat> Let's save this and whatever. Okay. Yeah, yeah, no. Okay, one second. Yeah, come on. Let's go with that. Okay. No. Okay. Let's see if this works better. My hand's gonna be like frozen for a second. One second. While I figure out what the heck is going on. Uh, boop. Let's see if this works now. Or it wants to work now. Who knows? There we go! It works! It works! Ah! I figured it out. Yes! <laughs> okay. We're good now. We're good. We're good. We got... We got pen pressure? That? I don't think so. <laughs> uh, this is great! Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm gonna push this over to here. There we go. So is this gonna work now? Okay, it works! Okay, the buttons are working! Woo! Buttons are working! Oh yeah, there's little buttons on the side to do like little shortcuts. So I have one for uh, Control-Z, Redo, Copy-Paste. Uh, there's a dial, which is... I love the dial. The dial does this. <laughs> Uh, you can use it for, uh, it depends on what you use it for, but, um, the options are either to, like, do it so you can zoom in and out really quickly, or you can do it for, like, brush size or whatever, so you can, um, change the size without actually manually needing to change it up here. Which I might change it to that, I don't know. Uh, then the rest of them are just random things, so I can, like, uh, deselect things when I use a selector or whatever, so, like, if I do this... There's like a little, you see this? This is, this is a select thing. So whatever is in this button, in this button, whatever's in this circle, uh, you can, uh, move. One second, let me, yeah, whatever's in the circle can move now. Move, look at that. Um, let's not do that. But now, you, you, you can't like, you know, draw anywhere around it and whatever, you know? It, it, you're just stuck. So how do you do that? On uh, here, you have to check for the, um, shortcut for it. But you can deselect things. And I think deselect is shift D, I think, on this one. I don't, I don't know. Or, no, 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 it's shift control A on this. It's, it's really weird. Um, like other programs, usually it's like shift, shift D or control D or something like that for like deselect. But on this one, it's not. So they, they, Krita just wants to be difficult. You can like change it, whatever, manually. So it's fine. Okay. You might hear my dogs barking in a second. Uh, <laughs> my parents just got back from work. So you you might uh you might hear some dogs start barking at the garage door opening. Do, do not do not fear. There is there is no burglary at this house. Uh bu -bu -bu. So yeah. Uh let's go back to here. God. Oh. Hold on. Wait a second. Ah, uh, shaved it shaved. <laughs> It saved. I can't talk. It saved onto the same thing. I'm going to go back to here and do it here then. Okay. Whatever. It's fine. There we go. Ooh, ooh. 
Hey. Wait, I do want to do more videos on like digital art specifically rather than just drawing. Um, so I do want to do that because I, I, I know that more than anything else. And with the tablet, hopefully it'll be easier to draw things and stuff instead of having to like draw my tablet, then import it onto my computer through like a Google Drive thing or something, and then doing all the other stuff. Oh, there's a the garage. <laughs> hopefully you can't hear that. It's a little louder since like the garage is like right under my room. So my entire room like vibrates whenever anyone actually uses it. Okay. But, uh, boop -a -doo. So hopefully with this tablet, it makes my life a little bit easier. Because Procreate's great, because Procreate, I, I, I use Procreate. Um, because you can like save things in many different forms and stuff like a PSD file or a JPEG or a PNG or something. But um, I'm dumb when it comes to technology, so I don't know how to save onto my computer other than just like going through Google Drive, then downloading on that, and then downloading it back onto my computer, and then and so on and so forth. So it's a little dumb. <laughs> so thankfully, hopefully, with this thing, I can, I can, uh, you know, make that a little bit easier for myself. Hopefully, maybe. So my my uh my art skills definitely need to to <laughs> get better than that though. So sadly, there is no easy fix for that. That's just uh, that's literally just a skill issue. <laughs> um, maybe I should do it like uh, I don't know what's going on here with the brush. Oh nope, I'm trying to move you. I do want a different brush though. This stuff is just. I don't understand why the pen pressure isn't working. Do 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 do. But I was also able to like change the background to something a bit more visually pleasing because the default is white and we do not use the white screen of death and destruction and everything. Okay, then we're gonna go back to here. I literally have a shortcut for that. Why am I going back up there to do it manually? Right there. <laughs> mm. I like doing this thing with eyeballs to make them look more, I guess, dynamic where um, the more higher up it gets, like this little middle area here, I try making that line skinny. I feel like it, 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 uh, it makes it look a little bit better. I don't know. It might be me just being delusional, but I try to, like, kind of make it so where it connects to the eyeball, the lines are a little bit more, like, bigger. But, of course, this is easier when I have freaking pen pressure, but whatever, Krita. <laughs> oh, wrong button. And then, as you can see here, uh -huh, drop putting these is, like, lighter. Hmm. Uh, I'm still not that advanced when it comes to art stuff, so, um, I'm still trying to figure out style and all that, which, um, I might do a video on that later on, just because style is always, like, one of those questions that a lot of beginner artists have, because, you know, they want to, you know, separate themselves from the, everyone else and whatever, and they want to make their own style, because, you know, arts, artists have, like, styles of art and stuff, like, no one style of art is going to look the exact same as something else, unless you're on a TV show. <laughs> In which everyone somehow knows how to uh, freaking draw Mickey Mouse the same. Which, if anyone's ever tried drawing Mickey Mouse, Mickey Mouse is so hard to draw right. I don't know what it is. I cannot draw him right. He always looks like a man in a mascot costume. Like those like old 80 versions of uh, Mickey Mouse where like the mascot heads are like 
really weird looking. <laughs> Cause it's like, it, it should be easy. It's just him doing, that's terrible, but. We're just gonna, we're just gonna forget. I, and yeah, okay. And you think it would be easy because he's just a, but like, look at him. <laughs> he's just literally three circles, and somehow I can't even get that right. Like you, you can, you can literally tell. I need to work on my circles. Oh my god. Whatever. We're not gonna. We're gonna get rid of the circles. <laughs> this is why I sketch things on a different thing before I put it in here. Okay. But usually with art styles, art, you don't usually have an art style straight off the bat because you don't know how to draw things. You kind of need to learn how to draw first, like the big fundamental things. Um, and then you can kind of break those rules a bit to get to your art style. Um, and no art style is completely like original, I guess you can say. Like each artist have their like inspirations into how they make the characters the way they look. Um, and that's through, like, studying art other artists and stuff like that. See how they do things. See how they draw the eye and what makes it so that... What is it about their art specifically that makes you really like it? Whatever. And... Uh, boop, boop, boop. And, 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 yeah. And um, you kind of just kind of mix and match in, like, a big old Frankenstein thing. Where, oh, you like the artist, the, the, how this artist does eyeballs, and you like how that artist does hair. You can kind of mix mash into both of them, and then you have the way you draw your hair and stuff. Um, but to be able to do that, you kind of need to know how to draw the eyeball in the first place to be able to draw a different type of eyeball. Um, so, yeah. In which I'm still trying to do that. <laughs> Because each time I draw something, it looks completely different from each other. It's a, it's a problem. I'm surprised no one has, like, um, what's it called? Have, like, called me out for, like, plagiarism and stuff. Because I'm not necessarily plagiarizing. But it looks like I am. Because every single time I ever draw something, it looks completely and utterly different <laughs> from the one before it. Oh my god. Here we go. So I'm surprised no one has ever said, like, Oh, this person's plagiarizing because they don't have a consistent art style. It's because I'm really bad at that part. <laughs> like, the way I look, you see me, my little, where I'm pointing at with my, with my hand? Me? Myself? Myself looks very different from the art style of my hand. This is not the hand you would expect this one to have, you know? And this is not the exact same way I drew my little chippy character. And, um... And this doesn't look like how I draw things. Like this and this are very different from each other. I don't have a consistent art style. And I'm surprised no one has ever like said, oh, this person plagiarizing. You can see whatever. Because usually you can tell if someone's plagiarizing by if like each time they draw something, it's very different from each other. And that's what I do. I don't plagiarize. I just have a very different Thing. I do something different every single time. Not on purpose either. I literally try to make it consistent and it does not work. <laughs> and I feel like the majority of the time it's just because I don't know how to draw things correctly. Like the amount of times I had to draw this character, you think this is more simple pose. She, there isn't any kind of foreshadowing or anything. This took like three hours trying to figure out how to place his hand. And it's and I still don't like it. So yeah. <laughs> Uh, so I kind of need to learn how to do anatomy and stuff. Hmm. Yeah, I just need to get actually consistent in practicing. Because, um, before, I used to draw all the time. But it wasn't most, it, well, it was also that I liked drawing. But it wasn't all, and just that. It was also the fact whoop, that I also just kind of had the kind of motivation to do it. Because I... If you haven't noticed with the amount of time I've been talking, um, I personally have uh, ADHD, so I get distracted pretty easily, and I have a lot of problem with like motivation and all that kind of stuff. I feel like when it comes to YouTubers, you kind of need to have ADHD. <laughs> the amount of times I've seen a YouTuber, and they say they have ADHD, and I can see it. I'm like, 
is this like a prerequisite for the job? Like, do you need to have a agent to have a job? Like, uh, what, who are the people that I know have a Like, a lot of the people in Niji Sanji that I used to watch, I think there's like 14 people in there that have ADHD. The pe some people in Hollow Life. Which is, these are like VTuber companies and whatever. Uh, does Shoto have ADHD? I don't remember. Like, a lot of people have ADHD. Kuro. Kuro has ADHD. Um, freaking. I think Markiplier has it too. <laughs> Markiplier. And does Jacksepticeye have it? I don't remember. I haven't watched Jacksepticeye in so long. And I never really watched him as when I was younger. Um, but yeah. But uh, anyways. Back to the point though. I have ADHD. And so for me, getting motivation to do things is really tough. There's a thing called, uh, I think it's something paralysis. Uh, I can't remember the whole term of it. But it's basically when... Um, you literally cannot get yourself to do anything. And it's not just like, oh, I'm lazy. I don't want to do things. It's literally like, you know, you have to do it and you want to kind of do it. Like, you, you know, you have to do it. You want to do it. But you're just like, no, <laughs> your brain is being a little brat. And it's just like, nah. <laughs> and then if you try, you have a little tantrum in your head and you're just like, yeah. But um, so when I was in school, the way I got around that, um was mostly through like friendly competition but the thing is i wasn't actually competing with anyone i was comp like i had this thing in my head being like oh i have to get better than this person because competition but they didn't know i <laughs> they didn't know that they were my rival i have a couple of friends they're all artists a lot of my friends are artists actually <laughs> um and at school i would usually like use them being like oh they can draw this better than me i have to get better at it so i can beat them but it wasn't a competition <laughs> <laughs> but it was the way that I, um, I got, I got to do, to motivate myself to do stuff. But since now we're like in different schools and so on and so forth, um, I don't have that competition. And so I need to kind of figure out a different way to get the motivation that I need to do the things that I know I need to do, like learn more stuff when it comes to anatomy and things like that. Um, so my art has taken a bit of a fall uh from because of that since i've not been able to kind of figure out what how to get my motivation because you know sometimes you just you don't have motivation to do stuff and you kind of need to do it anyways but i i'm lazy <laughs> so i kind of need the motivation to do something for me to do it so mm, which streaming in this case is my motivation oh hello Hello, missed you. I miss, I miss talking to someone that isn't just myself. <laughs> uh, I'm happy you had your bathroom break or talking to someone or whatever you were doing, but welcome back. Not much has changed. I figured out what was wrong with my tablet, so I just had to turn it off again, on again. <laughs> the basic things. Uh, bah, bah, bah. And as you can tell, I haven't done much. The pen pressure still isn't working. <laughs> so that's fun. Uh, eh, boop. But what do you usually draw? I'm just curious. Usually for me, I draw more characters. You draw like animals, characters, backgrounds, whatever. I know a lot of people like drawing different things. I just draw drawing cute people. Very cute people. <laughs> Not all chibi, but... Oh. One second.
Hello, I'm back. Sorry, I was gone for a second. My uh, mom wanted to ask me a question about something. Anyways, hello. Um, oh, there's a question. Yay. VTuber stuff. VTuber stuff? That? I feel like I feel like I have a very generic answer to this. Um, there is a big VTuber that I personally love. And um, she, I think she was the first VTuber I've ever seen. And her name was Iron Mouse. She's literally the VTuber. <laughs> the VTubers. Satan herself. But um, for her, I watched a lot of her stuff. And after a bit, my, a lot of my friends, um, or at least specifically one person, um, really said that, you know, since I was very bored because I just got out of school and it was still kind of COVID stuff and whatever, but it was like the aftermath. Um, I kind of had a lot of random thing and random time. I just didn't have a lot of things to do. Not that I went out anyways. I don't really touch the rest that much. But, um, you know, I just had a lot of very boring time in my room and I liked drawing. And that was literally the only thing I would do. But um, after a bit, after watching her specifically, um, my friend was like, you know what? Whenever we're on a Discord call, you talk so much. You should probably be like a, like a YouTuber or something. You have, you have to like stream something because... I can't be around you 24-7. You can't just talk to me for hours on end. I'm like, yes. But also, I don't like showing my face on things because I don't like getting ready. I don't need, I don't like makeup and stuff. And I usually look very tired um, sometimes. So I kind of just, uh, what's it called? Eek. Um, and whatever. And I just, I just don't like, you know, having to do stuff. <laughs> Um, like getting ready and stuff and and plus seeing Iron Mouse and the way that she's able to like kind of you know have so many models she has so many models so many there's literally I think there's an encyclopedia of how many models I think she's on like model 50 or something like I, I there's just so many <laughs> and then after that I saw other VTubers that she would also collab with and I was like huh this is an actual thing <laughs> and then I looked into it and it's somewhat easy to get into, I guess, kind of. And I was like, hmm, look at that. And plus, I just don't like showing my face in general. Like, I, bear I never take photos of myself um, and whatever. And I'm, yeah, I, I, I would. But bleh, bleh, what was I saying? <laughs> I had a brain fart for a second. <laughs> But you should! It's fun! It's 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 fun. <laughs> Plus if it's just a hobby, it's just fun. There's not much um things into it and whatever. And I and I like talking into a camera and being funny and whatever. Um and I feel like most people since YouTube started, I feel like most kids want to be YouTubers when they grow up. And of course not everyone can, because you know. If everyone can do it. What's that thing? <laughs> You know, not everybody can do it. Because not everybody, you know, can do things. Because some people are better at other things than others and whatever. Um, But the big thing was is that I didn't want to have a lot of the problems that I see a lot of, like, face streamers and things like that have. Um, And I kind of wanted to have my Hannah Montana moment, okay? <laughs> I want to do stuff and not, you know, because I don't like a lot of attention on me and whatever. I want to go out and do things and then be normal and whatever and then come home and be like, Aha! Nobody knows I am a streamer. Because <laughs> I feel like if anyone actually knows, it would be very embarrassing. <laughs> but, um... But yeah. My parents... Well, my dad, I don't think he really understands it. <laughs> my mom understands it and she knows about it. My dad... I, I don't think he really understands how YouTube works sometimes. <laughs> like, he watches a lot of YouTube. I just don't... I feel like it kind of goes over his head a little bit. But, whatever. Um, other than that, I have a couple friends I kind of know. I don't think they know of my channel specifically. Um, I think they just know I make videos in general. <laughs> and I kind of wanted to make it stay that way, because I don't want them to think... Yeah, do, do stuff. <laughs> Um, I, I don't, I want, I don't want to get teased off of, like, how I sound in videos. <laughs> and whatever. But, 
Um, but yeah, and plus with VTubers, um, you can literally make yourself into anything. You can make yourself Satan yourself, aka Iron Mouse. Well, I hit my mic. <laughs> um, or you could, you know, make yourself a dinosaur. Well, whatever. <laughs> In my case, a lot of my features on on myself are very much like me in real life. It's just obviously I don't have those clothing. I wish I did, but I don't. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just, you know, I, I, I like wanting to do whatever I want. I want to, to draw all of the things that I don't have the actual confidence to, to wear in, in actuality. And whatever. And plus, you can make so many stories, and I'm animation person, so I like making stories <laughs> and stuff. I have a lot of OCs and characters and whatever. I have my own comic. Like, I really like telling stories. And, um, and so I just kind of, you know, have that opportunity now to do that at some point in the future, if I get to it. <laughs> What's the button again? Okay, there it is. Oh, yeah. But starting the channel is actually pretty easy. You just need an email, make the, make the channel on YouTube, blah, 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 blah. But what would you want your channel to be about exactly? Like, it's gonna be about hard stuff? Whatever, what do you think? Because I personally still don't know what I'm doing. I think it's mostly art stuff, but... <laughs> my videos are kind of all over the place. <laughs> I have, like, DC comic stuff. I have, like, tutorial videos, comic videos, stuff. The comic videos are specifically because I just have, oh, I have my own comic. I, I'm on a the Webtoon comic Discord thing, and I was like, you know what? I want to make more videos, but I don't know about what. So, people, give me your comics. <laughs> and the comic review series was born. A lot of the stuff I do on here is just because of plain boredom. I don't have a lot of code in my life. I'm not a very interesting person. But, um, uh, yeah. Mm. This is This is why I don't like the little eraser button up there. It's just me. <laughs> I forget I have it on and then I accidentally erase something. That have to, like, control Z stuff. And then, I hate all this. I don't hate it, but. Yeah, I hate it at the moment. <laughs> there you go. Mm, that's good enough. Whatever. This is this is this is great. This is amazing. Okay, there we go. Also, quick question. Is the stream okay with you guys? I keep getting, like, random things popping up on my side. Hmm. Oh! That would be cool. Do you want to do, like, more... Putting on, like, a physical mask? Or, like, VTuber stuff? Ba -ba -ba. At first, I just kind of did... I um I did want a VTuber model, but I also was was uh, planning on sometime doing like Okay, good. But um I just kinda there was a point where I was just going to have like a literal mask over my face. I do have a video where I literally do that. It was fun, but still. Yeah, that's cool. Be like a skull mask or like a weird dino mask. <laughs> For me, I just have like random COVID masks laying around. Uh. But yeah, reaction. I I personally am a little bit addicted to the like whoop, to the um reaction video like channels. Like I <laughs> I watch so many of them. I just love people's reactions to stuff. Like even when I'm watching a movie. I will constantly look at my parents who are watching the movie with me and just be like, what are they doing? Are they laughing? Are they not laughing? <laughs> so 
So I personally really, really like, uh, I really like reaction channels. I think that's a really good idea. Eh. Eh. I just have to be careful of uh, copyright stuff because, you know, that's always amazingly fun to deal with. Yeah, that would be fun. In school, I um, had a project at one point to, like, make a mask. It was, um... It was... It was these... I didn't, I, I, I didn't do it. I made someone else do it for me because I did not want to put the stuff on my face. But, um, but there, there are, wait, um, I used to have to do that for like projects and stuff. What am I looking for? Right. It's up here. God dang it. <laughs> and I, I am, uh, Puerto Rican. So I, oh, come on. There is a, holiday in Puerto Rico where basically there is a can't um I do talk Spanish but my accent's terrible um there is a a holiday where it's like ve 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 this oh my god I can't speak it's like these men and women in like masks and costumes and stuff and they make like custom masks and they have like horns and stuff on them it looks really fun but it only happens like once a year and I really want to go but it's in Puerto Rico and I'm not on the island sadly <laughs> I'm on the mainland but, um, it looks really fun. It's really dumb, but it's really fun looking. Oh my god, I can't. There we go. The erase things, hello. Can I please? There we go. There we go. Oop. Oh, god. Dang it. It's, it's, it's so bumpy. This is so bumpy. I don't, this is so bumpy. I hate this. I hate this so much. And then his actual earring isn't circle. God. There we go. Make his little nose. It's always so, it, I always find it weird when I was younger that like anime people just have like little triangle noses. They don't even have a nose. It's just a line. Majority of them I'm especially in like, um, I think the one I can think of is like Sword Art Online, where they're like looking forward and they just have a line that's just like, this is nose. <laughs> just, this is nose. <laughs> Which I personally like right now. I'm, I'm happy to not do a, do a thing. But I, I don't like drawing noses. Noses are weird. And like most of the time, the when I was younger, to be able to draw a nose, because, you know, I had to draw noses in art school. Um, I learned this trick from a YouTube video where if you, this is something that you're never going to look at, at a nose the same again, but making a nose is literally just making a frog. So you have the, these things, and then you have a little frog. Boop, 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 boop. But yeah, there, there's your nose. <laughs> you have a little frog. And then of course you could just like do the little nostrils and stuff and like change it up and whatever. So you can do whatever and whatever but um it's just a little upside down nose that's what i used to do this is like mario's nose right here mario <laughs> but yeah i don't do noses very well so i'm happy to just do the triangles yeah yeah i think it's like any it's like this giant parade thing um that they do every year it, 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 some of the traditions are really weird sounding. <laughs> um, my mom, well, my mom never, like, actually participated in it, but, like, since she's, she was in Puerto Rico at the time, like, she kind of had to deal with it. But some of the stuff that she says that goes on on that holiday is so weird. It is so, and I understand where it came from, but it's so weird. <laughs> oh, there's something going on. There we go. Oh, I don't have my glove on. That's why. That's why. Ah. Eh. You have to for some of these things. You have to kind of wear a glove on, so you like your it doesn't track your palm instead of the uh, instead of the 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 the, 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 the pen. I forgot to put it on. <laughs> We're good now. Okay, good. Oh yeah, that, oh yeah. That's the reason why um on my character, 
because uh, I do a lot of art stuff. That this that, that is why I have um. Let me see if I can if I can uh, grab myself. Where where am I myself? Where am I? Where am I? Uh, there's so many layers of stuff. No. I have, um, I don't have lights, sorry, but th this is the reason why I have, um, little gloves on my hands and stuff, because, you know, the art gloves are usually only, um, on the two fingers, and then you have, like, your thumb and pointer finger free, and I don't, I don't have five fingers, okay? I have four fingers, no judge, but, um, eh, eh, there you go, I'm back. Yeah, it, 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 I still don't know if I want to settle with the character design I have right now, but, um, yeah. But anyway, back to point. What was I talking about? Oh, yeah, the hol holiday. So, the holiday is basically, I don't know what the origination of this holiday is, but I do know some of the things about it. So, the Vigantes are in a giant parade, and they have these big robes on, the, the, uh, the masks that they make. A lot of, I think... She said that a lot of kids make them at school, too. Um, and they're just, like, big mischievous monsters and stuff. So they <laughs> just go around and just cause mischief. Just just annoy people, which sounds amazing to do. But... <laughs> and sometimes they have this thing. This is going to sound so weird. This is going to sound so weird. <laughs> but they... <laughs> <laughs> so dumb. I'm going to tell you first what it is now because the old version of it is so weird. So they usually have like I don't know what's in it exactly anymore, but it's like this little bag. So like think of like a balloon or like a bag of some sort, a uh, small one, like little one, and then they put like a ball in there or like some flour or something to kind of give it some weight. Um, if you watched iCarly, think of like the peanut butter sock. <laughs> um. And then they would hit people with it. Or they would just have a stick and hit you in the butt with it. <laughs> um, really telling you you have a stick in your butt. Okay, anyways. But, so. And, blah, blah, blah. and that's already, like, it, it, it's funny. It's kind of weird. It's funny, though. It's weird that it's a holiday. <laughs> it still sounds funny. Um, but the original way of this. <laughs> it's so dumb. <laughs> um, the original thing of it was that you would have a bowl yeah like the butter sock thing yeah um you would i can't even say it. it's so dumb you would have a bull's testicles and you would smack people with it like you would inflate it and like smack people with it <laughs> of course they don't do that anymore because the poor bulls <laughs> also it's kind of gross but uh, now they just do the like basically a butter sock, <laughs> except a little less lethal. <laughs> um, I don't know where it originated because it's so weird. <laughs> but um, but yeah, <laughs> it is it is so weird. And they also just cause mischief in general, like jump scaring people and whatever. Um, it's so weird. <laughs> but yeah. That that's that's what they do. <laughs> My mom never actually participated, sadly. But um uh, yeah, that's that's the that's the thing they would do. <laughs> it is so dumb. It is it is so dumb. God. Okay, oh, yeah, there you go. But yeah, they're they're the masks themselves are kind of scary, but I kinda like scary things. I, my favorite holiday is Halloween. I, I do scary. <laughs> um, oh, I did want to do... Uh, speaking of it, though, I did want to do a fan mascot thing. I'm still trying to find an animal, but I think because, you know, I like scary things as well as I do like DC and stuff, I wanted to make it like a bat creature type thing. Um, So, yeah. <laughs> so, I, I, I'm still trying to figure out what to do for it. Because, you know, I, I don't draw animals that often, but I also am bored. And I would like to have, like, a little, like, um... Thank you! 
thank you. Everyone in my family only likes Christmas. And I'm like, Halloween, though. It is, it is such a great holiday. I love it so much. But, um, but yeah, so I wanted to make a little bat creature. And I don't draw things very often. <laughs> so I kind of have to figure out how to do that. But I wanted to have, like, a little bat creature that's kind of on the screen or whatever. And then, like, you would be able to, like, interact with it with, like, either, like, some sort of, like, command thing. Like, give it, like, food or, like, pat its head or whatever. Um, and then later on have, like, a TTS thing where it's, like, you type something in after doing something, whatever. And it would actually, like speak what you wrote out and whatever in like a weird voice i still need to figure out which voice i wanted to do though <laughs> there's so many voices i can make it into like the president's meme where it's just like a weird like joe biden voice or something or like c3po or something i don't know but um i feel like it would be very fun and also the amount of mischief somebody could do with that power <laughs> and so i well, so i really want to do that but i also want to kind of make it interact well, interactable with me so when it comes to uh eh, eh, eh. one second i need to move the tablet <laughs> okay there we go so when it comes to this uh one second. when it comes to like this thing this is kind of the base art of like when i actually have a 2d model because i do know how to make 2d models i have made them for other people too i haven't done it in a while and whatever but this is kind of the model art of like my face that i want to do and whatever kind of might tweak it a little bit but this is generally the face whatever and i do want to make it and then um on like the shoulder or something i would want it to have like you know the little oh one second <laughs> i would like to have the little back oh my god i can't ah what's going on here it is I have the little back this is terrible <laughs> Um, don't mind him. He he he's having a bad day. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> to have like a little back creature that kind of uh does like little animations or something. Like if you've had it said to have like a little, it does a little flip or something. Um, or it can like kind of perch on my shoulder like a little parrot or something. You know, I feel like it would be very fun. Um, and also I don't know how to do that, and I like learning new things, and I'm bored, so I really want to do that. <laughs> but yeah. One little bat creature. And also, bats are basically... If you ever seen, like, a video of, like, cute little bats and stuff, they're basically the puppy dogs of the sky. I don't know what specific, like, bat kind of feel I'm going for. Um, because at first I was like, oh, I want to do the Hurduran white bat thing. And I'm like, wait a second. It's a white bat. <laughs> I don't have anything to do with white anywhere on my stream. Why would I make him white? But, um... But there's also, like, other ones, like flying foxes and, like, this Australian bat. There's so many options. So many. And then I was like, wait, what type of bat do I want to do? Do I want to do, like, a fruit bat? Or do I want to do, like, a, you know, a vampire bat? As much as I love vampire bats, the idea of having, like, a little thing where you can, like, feed it or whatever, and then you can, like, feed it little strawberries or something is adorable and I can't get it out of my head. <laughs> So fruit bat it is, because just imagine it eating like a little banana or something. It's, it sounds so adorable. <laughs> I just actually have to draw bats. <laughs> that's that's the hard part. I actually need to learn how to do that part. <laughs> oh my god, I can't do this correctly. Need to zoom in. There we go. Eh? Eh, nope. Oh. Yeah. Well, yeah, I feel like it would be very, very fun to do that. Um, and that's also another reason why I have this one up for later on. So I can, um, you know, figure out what kind of thing I want to draw. Because I've already drawn this outfit. And this outfit has lore implications. But at the same time, after the lore implications, um, she would wear more, like, casual clothing. And, whoop. This is her, like, pre-lore outfit over here. Oops, whoop. Wait one second. This is her pre-lore outfit. You know? Me. Um, and I kind of want to make another outfit. I want to have a thing where you can kind of change the outfits. Stuff. A lot of these ideas are, like, kind of stolen from um, this other VTuber I know. 
again, another another guy. I watch a lot of guy VTubers for some stupid reason. <laughs> um, yeah. His name is Vane. He's very fun. Um, he's a bull VTuber, and he has this little pet um, called a bully. Um, and that's his, like, uh, his, like, um, fan name or whatever. It's, like, little bullies, which is adorable. Um, they also bully him, which is, you know, just kind of goes with the with the name there. Um, and he has a thing where you're able to redeem, like, different outfits. And then the outfit would change on his model and stuff. Like, you put on glasses, you can make him have gloves on, you can have him, like, a jacket. Um, some other outfits. <laughs> Not gonna say those ones um and whatever and i feel like that would be very fun to do have like little you know i could be in a giant comfy sweater or i could you know have like little sunglasses on whatever <laughs> yeah i feel like it'd be very fun to do so i want to do that stuff but to do that i kind of need to do the art for it and i'm kind of considering just like commissioning someone else to do the art because as you can see currently i'm having a lot of trouble <laughs> Um. And I haven't done, like, the model art stuff in a while, and I know how to do rigging. The rigging part isn't easy, but for me, I can, yeah, for me, I can do it. So, it's the art problem that I've been having recently. So, yeah, I might do this one more of a reference or whatever for them to kind of go off of to kind of make their own art for stuff. Um, but I don't know yet. I would definitely keep the chibi version of myself, though. <laughs> yeah. But I will, I will. But, uh, but yeah, I just have ideas, and I want to make them come true. <laughs> so, yeah. Um... Whoop. Come on. Yeah, but I have made my own models before. Um, I don't use them anymore. Because I kind of lost the files. <laughs> uh, so, yep. <laughs> but I have done other people's models before. Um, there's a model with a mutual of mine. I can't remember her name, but she's a koala. And I did I did her uh, chibi, chibi form for her uh, debut that she did. <laughs> I kind of have to remember her name. God. I don't, I'm very terrible with names. If anyone ever tells me their name, I'm going to be like, who? And then I see their face or their profile pic, and I'm like, oh, that person. <laughs> like, I do the exact same thing, even if the, like, the name is super, like, um, simple. I just can't remember the name. I have another friend. His name is, uh, Tuna. Uh, t is it Tuna? Yeah, it's Tuna. I think it's Tuna. It's, it's spelled, like, T-O-O-N-A. And there are so many times where I've talked to him, and I'm like, what's your name again? Oh, someone's at my door. One second. Hello, I'm back. <laughs> my my mom uh gave me chicken. <laughs> they got KFC. Is it KFC? No, it's Popeyes. I know some friends who would uh uh I know some friends who would completely and utterly just just astonished that I accidentally said Popeyes instead of KFC or something. <sighs> okay, there we go. I was doing so well yesterday in this tablet. Today, I can't even get the pen pressure to actually freaking work. I'm gonna try doing it again. <laughs> it's probably not gonna work again, but we'll see. Yes, chicken. I have now had chicken. I have my door my door locked because I also have like a little uh, little cousin who is very small, but he's very much. A person that does not know how to, um, shut up. 
<laughs> he his normal volume is yelling <laughs> and he throws doors open and stuff and then he will open the door look at you and then just go out again and not close the door it is so annoying <laughs> so i have my door locked and my mom's like why do you have this door locked i'm like there are reasons <laughs> and also you know him <laughs> um she's not actually mad at me she was just like what why 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 and she's holding a plate and she's like why do you have this door locked? i i'm giving you food but uh, this is great this is why i don't know what i'm doing okay let's see where would it be okay so it is working i don't know why it's not working working though go with this and see if that works i don't know we'll see if this works nope still nothing is this a krita issue i can't tell because i did the sensi sensitivity thing earlier to try figuring out what's wrong with the pen and for some reason it's still doing stuff Oop. We, we, yeah, yeah, there we go Let's see if that works i don't know There we go! <laughs> Figured it out. Yes! Haha! Uh -huh. Pen is fixed. This is great. Okay, wait. Oh, it's because it was on the wrong mode. Okay. It was not a crit issue. It was a me issue. It was a me skill issue. <laughs> Okay, let me switch my pen now to the other one that I was using. This is the one I like using the most. Because it's, like, solid most of the time. So it's a solid pen, but it's, like, actually solid. It's not transparent. <laughs> For the most part, I think. <laughs> eh. 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 There we go. There we go. Woo! <laughs> and also all of the freaking shortcuts are working. This is great. This is amazing. Yay! Things are working today. Boop. Yay! I am so happy this is working. <laughs> I was struggling so much. Okay. Eh. Boop. Boop. Nope. Oh, also, if you watch any other, um, like, artist people and you always wonder why the heck they keep, like, drawing something and undoing, drawing, undoing, draw, undo, draw, undo, draw, undo, draw, undo, <laughs> even though it basically looks like they're just drawing the same thing over and over again. It's because they're, um, at least for me, it's because um, when you're doing line art and stuff, you try to do it in one stroke and whatever. And if you don't do that, you have this, like, weird, like, chicken scratch thing where it's not very, like, solid. <laughs> um, I see a lot of, like, more beginner-ish um, artists do that where they're kind of afraid to do a big, bold line with, like, confidence and you know, stuff. And, and confidence is something I don't have. I just fake it. But, um, and so instead, they just kind of chicken scratch it, where they just kind of go along a lot to make a line, which one is, you know, more effort to do. Um, and two, it doesn't look that good. Unless you're making, like, fur or something. And even then, I wouldn't do that. That would be more of the coloring phase. But, hey! Eh. So for here, I was doing that. Yeah, and yeah. I just remember when I was uh, when I was trying to learn art, I was always be very confused about that. <laughs> like, why are they just doing the exact same thing over and over again? But now I understand why. <laughs> it's 
Hmm, other things I usually see a lot of like beginner people do. Hmm. I think some of the, some of the bigger ones I always like see that other artists are kind of annoyed by um, people asking a lot is like, what brushes do you use? What what is it? What do you use? And usually a lot of our artists, if they do have specific brushes, you can ask. But like, I feel like a lot of artists usually just use the basic brushes you have in your program. So like for me, I'm not using anything specific. I'm literally just using something that's already in here. Um, and I still don't like it. <laughs> I might download a different one because me. Yeah. But um, you don't need any like big specific brushes to do certain things. Like if you're trying to do like halftone stuff on your on your screen, which is like you know the um old like comic-y style where they have like a bunch of circles as shading, um, that. What am I going on? Okay, there we go. We're good. <laughs> um, usually you can make do with just the brushes that you're using if you're just drawing something that isn't like a specific type of texture or something. And even then you can just fake it. Um, uh, yeah. I don't really use any specific brushes. Like, I've tried using, like, customized brushes. I, I'm just... I just prefer the basic. <laughs> I'm a... I'm... I'm... I was about to say something bad. I'm basic. I'm just very basic. <laughs> yeah. But, yeah. Wait. Come on. This is one of those areas where I cannot make a freaking line to save my life. If they were like, make a straight line, otherwise, you know, you die. And I'm like, okay, just, just do it. <laughs> I can't. I cannot do it to save my life. What's another thing other than brushes? Hmm. Other things. Hmm. Oh, I think another one. I I talked about it earlier, but another one. That I used to see a lot of people is is that they try doing a thing where they try like figuring out their art style and so they watch like a ton of videos being like how do you find your art style what's how did you do your art style blah 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 blah, blah. and usually and if anyone were to ask me that question I would usually just say that like if you're a beginner artist technically you already have an art style it's however you actually draw in it, it's how you draw but when you're a beginner, I would say you don't really have one because you still need to figure out how to draw things and stuff. Like, you still need to learn how to do... If you want to draw, like, a, a stylized eye, you need to learn how to draw the eye first. Because if you just draw your eye like like this, you can't stylize it into into some sort of anime eye or something. Because you don't know how to draw the eye yet, you know? You still You still do the button eyes. How are you going to do this? <laughs> and so usually when it comes to that part, I would just say in the beginning part of how to draw things, I would just focus on fo just focus on drawing the fundamentals, just fundamental stuff, like drawing the like how to draw anatomy, how to how the face shape works. Um learning color theory all of that stuff even though most of that stuff i need to do myself <laughs> be and also just study all the other artists that you like i feel like a lot of artists usually have an art style but that's just because they have people that they look up to and they kind of just integrate it into how they draw like if you like how i don't know jazza draws his characters but uh you like how sam does art does his characters you can just mishmash them together and there you go a lot of art styles aren't really, um, original, really. And, at least in a professional sense, I feel like the majority of the time you don't need an art style. Because, in a professional sense, you just draw how your client wants you to draw a thing. Unless you're doing, like, commissions or something, then they, you know, they like how you draw, which is why they commissioned you. But, um, in, like, a professional space, like, say, for, like, a TV show or something. Everybody needs to draw, you know... Oh, I accidentally did that. 
um, everyone needs to draw the character the exact same way. And so, if you don't have an art style, or whatever, you don't have to be too, like, focused on it, because either, regardless of whether you do or don't, you're good. As long as you like drawing and you're learning how to draw and stuff, you don't necessarily need one. But if you want one, you just kind of study how people that you like draw art and just kind of integrate it with your own. As well as, you know, learning how to draw things correctly. <laughs> so, for myself, I don't have a consistent art style. I just kind of draw <laughs> random. Every single time I draw something, it's always in a different style, I feel. <laughs> Sometimes I have very similar things with each person. Like, um, if I ever draw a character, there's always something in the front of their head. I do not like drawing foreheads, like pulled back hair or something, because I cannot do it. <laughs> it just, they look like they have a five head. I can't, I can't actually make a forehead look good. And so majority of the time, they just have, like, at least one piece of hair in front of them. They don't have, like, a hairline, which I did it here, but I don't usually do that. <laughs> um... I just wanted to because I like the hairstyle. Woo! But, uh, well, yeah. Let's see what you do. I need to do one more. Yeah. Something I would usually not say to do. Zoom in more. Mm. Mm. The thing would be, I uh, don't zoom into things, even though I just said I need to zoom in. I need to zoom in because I can't draw a straight, like, curved line from out here. Well, you can't, but. Yeah. I prefer going zooming a little bit more to do it correctly. But, um, don't zoom in. Majority of the time, people are just going to be able to see it from far away. Nobody is really going to zoom in and notice all the small details that you added in there. Like, if you added, like, 10 billion highlights into something, people are just going to, you know, look at the collective rather than the specific things. And so, if you start zooming in, like, this much to the point where you can see, like, the shape of your freaking brush and whatever you're a bit too zoomed in <laughs> i would zoom out and stuff so you'd be able to you know focus on the big picture because not everybody is going to see those small little details i put little small details into my artworks just because you know i like the fact that you can like look at something and then you'll notice something different each time but it's not tiny things it's just like stuff that's just kind of hidden in there that you can see if you look for it not that if you can see if you zoom in 200%. Um, a lot of my, like, Batman videos, which majority of them are on TikTok, which that, that, that might not be a good idea, but, um, as of recent news, but, um, it, oh, I keep hitting my mic. <laughs> what was I talking about? Oh, yeah, um. Some of my older Batman videos have uh, stuff. Um, they have, like, stuff in the background. Like, there is a specific video that, for some reason, got stupid popular on TikTok. Um, it is so... Like, on most of my videos, if it's, like, something Batman or Marvel-related, it usually gets to, like, 3K views slash, like, uh, likes and whatever. That one TikTok about um, Batman needing a person to kind of be a substitute for the day um that tiktok has <laughs> i think it has like 160 or oh, 70 something k views on it like it is it is ridiculous how much that video specifically has blown up compared to the rest of my own like it's not viral or anything but it's it's more than usual <laughs> um and it continues to get views. Like, it's been, like, three months. It continues to be, like, my most popular video that people keep watching. <laughs> um, but in that video, in the background, um, it's Batman in front of his little back computer. In the background, you can tell it's, like, Valentine's. He doesn't say specifically why he's not going to be in town for the day. But through the background elements, you can see it's Valentine's. He has a missed call from Selena Kyle, who, if you know... Is Catwoman, which is his weird, estranged wife sometimes. Girlfriend, whatever. Depends on the timeline. <laughs> um, and stuff. And you can you can tell he's going on a date with Selena. And Selena, it, it seems like he's late. Because Selena keeps calling him and he does not answer. <laughs> um, 
But also in the background, you can also see that um, uh, Jason in the background. <laughs> you can see a little news article talking about how Jason gave um, Batman the runaround around the uh, the Wayne Manor and stuff. And then they're like, oh my god, they're at Wayne Manor. Does Wayne know about it? Oh my god. And then there's also another article talking about, oh, why is Batman at Wayne Manor so often? And they don't put two and two together being like, oh, Batman is, you know, <laughs> Batman's Bruce Wayne. No, no, no. Batman is seeing Bruce Wayne. <laughs> Valentine's edition. But, um, which I just find funny because they're not actually in the video. They don't get explained or anything like that. It's just in the background. And if you look at it, you'll be kind of able to piece it together. But, <laughs> but yeah, as well as like there's Nightwing holding a newspaper talking about how he was Batman last time, and guess what? He smiled in a picture and everybody's freaking out. <laughs> and they all know that's not Batman. <laughs> He's smiling. He's smiling for the camera. Um, but, yeah. I just find little details like that very, very funny. But, um, but overall, do not zoom in too much to put little details. Because little details, like how I mentioned, aren't that little. Like, you can see them very clearly. Um, but they're not super, super, like, zoomed in details. Which, um, which can make you kind of get a little bit, um, demotivated to actually finish the art thing that you're doing. Because, you know, you're spending so much more time doing those little details that you don't need to do. Hmm. And that is how a lot of artists in the beginning don't finish the art pieces. Other than the fact that artists just don't finish their art things. <laughs> I have so many drawings that I will never, I will probably never actually finish. For no reason, except I want it. <laughs> Are they bad? No. Are they good? I don't know yet, because they're not done. <laughs> it's a very weird thing that just happens with a lot of art people that they just like, uh, there is this one person who was making a video talking about, oh, how to impress a, you know, a beginner artist, make something super duper realistic. How to, um, what's it? Uh, how, how to impress like a middle advanced, just middle of the way average artist, make something super creative. And then how to, <laughs> how to impress an advanced, advanced artist. Actually finish your drawing. <laughs> It's not some big, like, Leonardo da Vinci piece. Make something for, the, like, the church. Make a Michelangelo statue or something. It's just, finish it. <laughs> that is the big, biggest flex. Finish it. <laughs> but, yeah. Well, that's another thing. My, my, my. my dog not but Chihuahua, she's a little bit hurt, as I mentioned earlier. Just making sure that she's okay. She's an older dog, so stuff happens to her a lot. Uh, but her doctor, vet, isn't in today, so I can't really take her today. It has to be, like, tomorrow or something. If they're open tomorrow, I have no freaking idea if they're open on weekends. stuff It's not turning out the way they wanted it. Yeah. Um. Hmm? Oh. 
Right. Yeah. Uh, I was just, uh, I was humming uh, Sway with me. <laughs> I have a project that I have to use that for, and it's just been stuck in my head forever. <laughs> God dang it. <laughs> ah, there we go. No, stop. Back to black, please. Thank you. For some reason, I have been watching a lot of like older songs, and I don't mean just nostalgic songs, I mean just like old, old songs. <laughs> you sway with me. I think a couple of Frank Sinatra songs have been stuck in my head. Um, uh, like Take Me to the Moon and stuff. Uh, other things. You know what? Let me switch to this one. I want to make clothing. Because this takes too long. And also, the freaking brush strokes aren't working. At least with this one, I could just do whatever and it doesn't matter. It's sketch. <laughs> Wait, I think you can. One second. Let me just merge all these together. One sec. Uh, merge your brush. There we go. Now I can just put this a little bit. Less opacity. And now we can figure out what to put in clothing. Woo! Okay, let's see. Um do, 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 do. Hmm, what to do, what to do, what to do. Maybe like a sweater or something. I don't know. I usually wear a lot more um I don't want to call myself emo because <laughs> I'm not sad. It's just uh, I wear a lot of black and stuff. I think the, the more appropriate title would be, like, alt clothing or something. Hmm. I like black and purple. Can you tell I like purple? <laughs> I feel like it's, uh, it's not very well known that I like purple. Purple. <laughs> but, uh, let's see. Maybe I should do, like, a little sweater or something. Let's go with sweater for now. Sweater! Because I really like, um, I usually don't really like these type of sleeves, but, like, it, they've been growing on me. Like, the sleeves that, like, kind of puff out at, like, the wrist. At first, I never really liked these, because I always felt like they made, they, like, they were just annoying to deal with. But I have a shirt now that's kind of like this one, I'm going to be drawing, that has that, and I am obsessed with it. <laughs> Which is something I never thought I would actually say. Yes, thank you. Somebody understands the purple. It's either that or like a dark green, mostly because of a certain character I'm really obsessed with, aka Loki. <clears throat> what? Anyways. <laughs> yeah. Uh, let's go. See, this is funner. I don't need to. I don't need to be worried about not doing things correctly because it's sketching. It's supposed to be many messy. It's fine. <laughs> but I do like putting on rain, so I'm gonna put. We're gonna have some rings. We're gonna be bling. We have a lot of bling or something. Uh, that sounds so weird coming out of my mouth. That's such an old term. Okay. Fine. <laughs> Make some rings. Ooh, actually, does she still have the gloves on? Eh, it's fine. Chunky ring. No, you didn't. You did not hear that. You shall not. No. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. You're talking crazy. <laughs> well, on our unrelated topic, um, do you have any favorite characters? I have favorite people, like people who play characters, aka Tom Hiddleston. That has nothing to do with anything you might have. Your mind might have thought you heard. <laughs> I feel like most people have, like, really, like, people that they're, like, obsessed with. Like, I don't know, people or, like, characters or something. You know, for me, it's a lot of Marvel characters. Nothing in specific, honestly. Um, nope, I did not want Disney Plus for a specific show. That I finally watched just after like a year of it being out. <clears throat> Nothing. 
what's the other characters I really like? I usually like a lot more villains. So like Shigo. I mean, who hasn't liked Shigo? I feel like Shigo is very universally loved for most people. Uh, what's the other ones? Sonic. So I was a big Sonic person. Then I saw Sonic Adventure 2, and then I was like, wait, Shadow, though. <laughs> Sonic, but dark and red. <laughs> um, and emo. <laughs> Even though his game was apparently really bad, Sonic's games, like, the Shadow game, theme, uh, theme, theme, theme song, whatever it's called. Yeah, it depends on the show. Um, hmm. Was it all of me? No, 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 no. All of me! Da, da, da. <laughs> or whatever it is. I can't sing. But, um, all of Sonic's songs are so good, though. But, um, what are the other ones? What are the other ones? Let's see. Hmm. My friends usually say I have a very specific type, and I do. I, I, at this point, I have to agree. At, at one point, I was like, no, I don't. I like a lot of different people. And then we did a thing where we had a kind of PowerPoint of, like, all the things that we, like, all of the people that we like. Or whatever. Um. What was the, it was a simplest. That was a, <laughs> we have, like, a PowerPoint of all the people we liked. And it was only then that I saw the trend. <laughs> um, there is, like, Gundam from Danganronpa 2. And then, what was the other ones? Danganronpa 2, Gundam, because he's adorable and I love his little hamsters. There was, um, Risley from Genshin. <laughs> um, the little ice boy from the French town. <laughs> Those the other ones. I do like Anim Ed 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 Amity. Amity from Owl House, but Hunter, though? I love Hunter. Those two. I love them. I'm very much loose in that show. Like, if there's somebody's personality in that show that I'm very much like, it is loose. Because <laughs> uh, cutting off my own hair with a sword, like a like a random toy sword, sounds like something I would have done when I was younger. <laughs> Thankfully, I was not allowed around very sharp objects. <laughs> um, one's... Wait, there's a, there is a, there's a bit, a little, little bit of a trend. Uh, Loki, which I never liked. And I, I never said I liked or anything. Uh, what else? V. Ooh, wait, which V? From what show? There's a lot of different Vs that are in my head right now. Oh, Fleet of, the Sonic actor? The, 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 the Fleet Away, the, the Sonic character with, like, the golden, with the big eyes. Oh, V, yeah, that V from Owl House. Yes, yeah, okay. There's a couple, oh. I, you know what? She's adorable, though. Especially her redesign later in the show. I I love the way she looks later on. <laughs> At first, she was adorable, because she just freaking loose with little clips in her hair. That that was so freaking cute. And then later on, it's just... She's so cute. She is so adorable. Her hair is so cute. And then, like, the fact that she still has, her like, her ears out in, like... Yes, target eyes, good to know. But um, man, she's she's very much adorable. And then her with um, who's that girl that she likes? Oh god, the goth girl that I love. I love her too. Uh, what's her name? God dang it. The other girl whose voice her her voice actor is the same voice actor as Azula from the Avatar: The Last Airbender series, and that just just makes it so much better. <laughs> and I think Amity is a uh, voice actor is also the same voice actor as Katara, which that is that was that was a thing. <laughs> that was something because I love Katara and I love Azula as much as Azula is a bit too crazy, but it's fine. 
nuzzle target eyes lead away that that one that's the person i have not heard of in so long hmm? Aww. God dang it. I'm I'm looking through like Google stuff for like uh owl house stuff and there's this one talking ah oh, it's so cute. Even though it doesn't make sense anymore. Ah, this is adorable. The freaking fan art for like Owl House and uh, Amphibia. I love them so much. Oh, somebody did with Aw, oh, so cute. This is adorable. Okay, anyways. People 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 draw things that are so cute. Okay. Back to the main goal, though. Oh, right. The shirt doesn't actually... This shirt actually doesn't go all the way down. I need to change that. Eh. Eh. There we go. I need to make this bigger. Da -da 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 -da. And there we go. I'm gonna erase a lot more of these, because they're too big. And then, so, put this back to the normal size, or whatever. Yeah. Bit too small. God dang it. There we go. Hopefully this is better. Eh, this looks better. As soon as the other two. Does she go? Impossible. That entire show, honestly. Um, I love that show so much. I was so offended when one of my teachers was like, Were you a part of the Kim Possible era? Because we have this running joke that, um, he's an old man, and apparently I'm the baby, um, because he was, like, a decade older than me, or whatever. And he's like, oh, is Kim Possible in your era, or is that something too old for you to understand? And I'm like, Kim Possible, like, came out when I was a child, thank you very much. Shigo, yes, I do understand what you meant, old man, but, um... He's not that much older. He's like 10 years older than me, but still. Old man. What's the other yeah, suit? Is... Hmm. Yeah, definitely from uh, from the Sonic franchise. Definitely freaking Shadow. Thank you. It's another Gen Z in the chat. Yes. <laughs> well, they just think because I'm Gen Z that apparently I just don't know anything. And I'm like, no. I was born at like the tail end of the 90s. Okay, I understand some of the 90 jokes. Okay, jeez. But, um, but yeah. <laughs> but yeah. Well, Disney's not been the same since, like, the early 2000s. Because those shows were great. Amazing. And now they're just canceling all the good shows. Like, they did not need to cancel freaking Owl House, but they did. And it's dumb. It was a dumb, stupid reason. But whatever. <laughs> yes, thank you. Thank you. I love Shigo so freaking much. I love her. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. There, there's this uh, other VTuber that... <laughs> she also loves Shigo. Shigo. <laughs> Shigo. Shigo has something to do with this. Shigo. But, for some reason, she has this thing in her head that apparently Shigo is not a very nice name to say. And so she calls her Shiego, which I feel like is worse. And she herself has said multiple times on stream, Shigo. She doesn't actually say Shiego, even though she says that, oh, her name is Shiego. I don't think she's actually watched the show. Because they never freaking say Shiego. Her name is Shigo. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's so... Hmm. Yeah, I feel like it was. Because they said that apparently it didn't fit their brand or whatever for Yaddle House. It was, it was so dumb. So dumb. So stupidly dumb. Because that show, like, that show had so many people watching it. So many people. Like, every single time they put it onto, like, YouTube, those things went on, like, the millions of freaking views. It was, hmm. And especially since the kiss was so cute. <laughs> it was so cute. It did. Like, my first kiss, like, whenever I, when I have my first kiss, it was just as awkward. And I love seeing it on screen because it is awkward as all heck. <laughs> as much as it is adorable and everything in between. It's also 
completely and utterly awkward, and then you're embarrassed about how you did it. <laughs> what did she even say? Like, didn't she say, like, crikey or something? <laughs> I had no idea she was Australian, but crikey. <laughs> that, that, that is the reaction you have. It was so dumb. But from what I know, though, from the, the kiss, I believe, was, like, during that last season. And so the, can the cancellation was due even before then. So, it was going to happen regardless. Yeah. It was, it's very dumb that it was going to happen regardless. But it was going to happen regardless, apparently. Because uh, they were originally planning for three seasons. And then COVID hit. And mm, so dumb. And then they had, like, a few hiatuses, which is normal for a show or whatever. And during that hiatus, that's when they were like, oh, actually, you know that third season you all wanted? Yeah, no, we're not going to do that. <laughs> We're just gonna, you know, cancel the stupid show. Now you only have three half-hour specials or whatever. And, and the amount of pictures that they have in their house during that first episode. Like, we were going to have the anime beach episode. I want the beach episode. <laughs> Please. And, like, the fact that we couldn't actually see Amity hanging out with Luce. And being like, oh, this is the human world. We have to go to our human date. We couldn't see the human world date either. Why? Why does they? Was, mm. The pictures were so cute. We needed those episodes. But no! No! God dang it. <laughs> ah, it's great. It's fun. It's. Mm. Thank you, Disney. And then Amphibia was able to go on for some stupid reason. Like, Amphibia could go, but not. Owl House, and then they also have another show, which is not as story based, but it is kind of in the same vein. Um, it's not as like it's more episodic. Um, what's the show called? I can't. Uh, Mo. Uh, the Ghost and Molly McGee. That was it. I love that show. It is so dumb. It is so cute. I love it so much. And that show as well, I think got cancelled. I don't know if it got cancelled or it's just because they only planned for having three seasons, but regardless, why? All the good shows lately only, like, go up for, like, a certain amount of time, like a year or two, and then they just get either cancelled, they're, like, the amount of episodes they have get shortened, or they just disappear into the ether. It is... Mm. It's not fun to watch. Ah. There you go. Nope. That's... Yeah. <laughs> I keep pressing buttons. No. You... No. You... Uh, that's way too big. Okay, wait. Hmm? That's way too small. And two. There we go. Da -da -da. Da -da -da. But yes, I have I have many of the opinion on freaking Disney at the moment. It's not even due to the fact that they're going through a midlife crisis when it comes to their live action movies. But god dang it, Disney! <laughs> like Disney didn't even get up to be able to was it? Disney wasn't able to go to what is the the thing called the Annie Awards? I think which is like the big animation awards that they've never not been able to go to, and freaking uh. The Amazing Circus got onto the Emmy Awards and Disney didn't, which is amazing, and I love that. That needs to be the standard. <laughs> we need those indie animations to go to the Emmy Awards because the Amazing Circus is just a, it, it's in the name. It's amazing. <laughs> I feel like they just really need to let the artists do what the artists gotta do instead of just being like eh, i don't like it take it off of here <laughs> make it disappear so damn i do love the fact that they didn't get to go and also like even in their good movies that like are actually good they keep just completely and utterly just missing everything like they just missed the target on some of the so many of like their good movies like, uh, Elemental, 
I haven't watched it, but it looks like an actually good movie. It's just at the time when it was coming out, I didn't want to watch it because the only thing I saw of the trailers was that stupid little like little kid that did that weird flower joke in the armpit thing, whatever it was. Meanwhile, the actual the actual movie was like a weird like Romeo Juliet um immigrant story thing and i love that idea but i didn't actually see it in the trailer so i never went to watch it and it seems like everyone else did the exact same thing because it didn't actually have a really good box office <laughs> thing but after the fact that's when like an elemental actually got pop more popular to watch because people were like oh actually this movie is good wait a second wait a second <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what to do for this though, but I'm gonna we're gonna go to Google Alt Outfit. Alt Outfit ideas. There we go. Let's see what we have. Yeah. Oh. Um. Hmm. Hmm. Because I don't want to do, like, the same thing everyone else kind of does, which is, like, the same type of skirt and shirt and everything. Hmm. I don't want to really go into tech wear either, because I feel like a lot of VTubers nowadays have a lot of tech wear -y type things. I just want to go, like, full emo mode on this. <laughs> hmm. So, even though I'm not emo, but uh, we're doing, we're going for that. Oh, this is cute. That shirt. Let's go off of this one. One sec. Let's just be brainstorming outfits. So I can all rice. Let's do this real quick. Stop it! One sec. Eh. Yeah. Move that. There we go. Yeah, man. Da -da 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 -da. Have an idea. We'll see how it works. Because these are going to be outfits that I wish I could wear. I do not have the confidence. Let's see. Uh, oh, still the working. Yes. <laughs> it randomly changed the color to white. Uh. Okay. There we go. Uh -huh. Okay. We'll see how this goes. Gonna have the Ariana Grande moment when it comes to the oversized sleeves. <laughs> I remember when everybody used to do that when like Ariana Grande was like the big popular thing to emulate, like uh, when she was in Victorious, which uh, Nickelodeon has a lot to answer for currently, but um, with like a very cutesy thing with like the oversized like shirts and hoodies and stuff. I remember so many people who would be, like, emulating her personality without being like, I, I don't know who Ariana Grande is. This is just my personality. <laughs> and I'm like, mm -hmm, you sure don't. Nope. While well, they try doing, like, a whistle note or something. <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah. So...
And then there's this thing that they also had here. Oh, may see how it looks. Don't know yet. Let's see, so they kind of have like a star thing. Mm. I've seen thing now, blah blah blah. Now the pants is where there is issues. Let's see. Should I go with like a skirt or with a pant? Hmm. Skirt or pant? Hmm? Yeah, I do. Yeah. I 100% can see it. Yes. Ariana Cat, Ariana Grande, yes. Honestly, for me, it was, um, at least in Victoria's, it was, um, I feel like more so, it was Jade. I love Jade in that so much. As much as she, you know, wasn't supposed to be that likable, <laughs> I guess. Um, I loved her. So much. But yeah, especially when it came to the um take a hint song when she did like the the talking in that one. Um like one, two, three that thing. Yes. <laughs> I love all the songs from that movie. Movie? No, show. I think there was a movie. I don't remember though. Gonna go with that. I don't know yet. Hmm. I don't know if I should go with the skirt or with pants. Hmm. Oh yeah, Jade and Sam. Yeah, Sam. I can also understand. <laughs> Sam was just very fun to watch on screen, honestly. I just wish they actually picked somebody for Freddy. Like, it was so much back and forth. Oh, it's gonna be Carly. Oh, it's gonna be Sam. Oh, Sam, we're actually, Sam and him were actually together. Actually, they broke up. Actually, they got back together. Actually, they broke up. <laughs> Carly has no freaking idea what's going on. <laughs> that entire plot line was so annoying. Because <laughs> I just wanted Freddy to be happy. He is such a good dude. And he keeps, like, he, ke he keeps not getting the girl at the end. And he's actually a sweet dude. Like, sure, at the beginning, he was more stalkerish. But, like, after a bit, he actually, you know, he, he, he grew up a bit, you know? He is a cool dude. And then, nope. I don't think even at the end of the show, they actually, like, confirmed or denied <laughs> if he was with anybody. I know they have a new show on, um, Paramount Plus, which I'm not getting because it's, eh. But, um, apparently it was canceled. Which is weird, because I do know the last scene from that show is uh, Carly's mom being invited to something. And then they never actually showed her mom. <laughs> Which, wow, okay. <laughs> Just gonna freaking make it not make it end on a cliffhanger there. <laughs> you want to finish a show that you grew up on and now you have a reboot and it it, it doesn't seem terrible? Nah. <laughs> You shall not. And then he actually has, like, a wife. Or had a wife. It looks like Freddy had a wife. I don't know who it is. They have a kid. 
I don't know if the kids adopted or not. It's just a kid now that's just kind of there. <laughs> They just wish for him to be happy because then they started getting he he got he got a wife they got divorced he got a kid so he's never had good relationship things yeah he had he was with sam broke up with sam got to sam again then carly i don't know what the heck happened there and then he got married years later had a kid or you either had a kid or adopted a kid don't know um did that they still divorced <laughs> Then he's with Carly, and then they start arguing because I've seen so many like clips of that series of like just them arguing, and it, it always seems like Carly is in the wrong. Because <laughs> there was this entire argument about the fact that like there was I don't know if it was an episode or not where Carly was gonna go to Italy. I think I think she went to Italy at the end of that show, um, and she said something to make it sound like um he was that she was interested in freddy like as she was going off or whatever or something like that i can't remember specifically and then when he went to visit her in italy thinking that you know what she said at the airport was actually you know something he <laughs> she was like what no <laughs> i don't actually like you like that <laughs> meanwhile he was going there in the intention in his head was like that she liked him because of the hint she gave towards him. And then she's like, no. Even though, from what I remember, the hint was very obviously like, oh, I like you. And then she just completely and utterly backtracked on that part. <laughs> and then, um, apparently, he went back home after sleeping at the airport. Oh, at the airport. And because, you know, he was upset and everything. He went all the way to see her. And then she's like, actually, no, I don't like you. <laughs> And so he, he left, was upset, went back home, slept at the airport, which was a bit earlier than he was supposed to leave at. He was, I think, going to stay there for a couple of days, and he only stayed there for, like, one. Um, and then years later, she, like, he explains it to her. And then she's saying that, oh, that wasn't my fault um, or anything like that, even though it was very obvious that she was giving him hints. There were so many times throughout that trip, apparently, that she was giving him hints, and they went on a date. Like, they full-on went on a date solo to a restaurant, fancily dressed and everything. And then somebody, and then, uh, what is it? Somebody came, like, a waitress came over being like, oh, are you two together or whatever on a date? And then they didn't know what to say until Carly laughed and said, oh, I would never, we're just friends. Making the implication that, like, she would never want to be with him in any sort of way. <laughs> Which he was upset again because again it seemed like they were on a date and she never like specifically said they weren't on a date. <laughs> and then he was upset and then she was saying something about like, oh, you shouldn't be upset because I never said it was a date. But at the same time, you never said it wasn't a date. <laughs> they, she, he full on paid for your meal. He He literally flew out to Italy to see you again. You made so many hints towards the fact that you liked him before and after the move to Italy or wherever you went. And then you're upset that he thought that you two could... Could... And, like, I understand that in the case that she was actually, like, not intending for that to happen, I completely understand that she obviously would not have fault there. But at the same time, throughout that entire argument, she was making it seem like he was completely and utterly in the wrong like, so, so wrong for all the things that he assumed, and this and that and the other thing. Even though he's also entitled to his own feelings. They're both entitled to their feelings, but they shouldn't, she shouldn't have, like, completely inviscerated the idea that, like, oh, he's upset. He slept at the airport on the floor. He was upset. And then you're like, you shouldn't have been upset. I'm sorry, but you shouldn't have been upset. <laughs> he was upset! He's, a, he's allowed to be upset about something that he thought was going to be true. But yeah, there's a lot of arguments in that where Carly just seems very oblivious and very naive as if she's still 14. It's really weird. <laughs> and I think somebody is getting married or something later on because I don't that show just seems very um something. Every single time I see a clip, it's just something very random going on. <laughs> but yeah, and also the fact that, you know, I don't think 
Sam and Freddy got together because Sam isn't in the show because of obvious uh, reasons. <laughs> but um, but yeah, it's just just just, it's, just let him be happy. <laughs> I want Freddy to be happy. He's such a cool, like he's such a nice dude. He doesn't do anything. He's just there for the girls and everything. He's not even that pushy. Like he. He's just a good dude, and everybody keeps giving him hints, or he keeps getting into relationships, and then they're like, actually, no. I don't want to be in a relationship with him. God, his, his reputation with the girl. <laughs> with women. <laughs> uh, anyways. But I will say that uh, I love the fact that iCarly and Victoria's got so many seasons and everything, and even got like a few crossover episodes. Meanwhile, a lot of shows today can't even get, like, past three, two seasons a season. <laughs> even finish the story. Uh. So much. It's so much. Right, I was supposed to be drawing stuff. <laughs> okay. Pants. Drawing pants. Should I put up boots? I feel like boots would look good. Um, we'll see. So if I did have boots, it would uh, have like a thing here, and then <laughs> I'm gonna do the Kim Possible legging pants, cargo pants thing, majig she has. I started wearing cargo pants when I was little just because of freaking um, Impossible. <laughs> I didn't get like cream colored ones because on my skin tone that it just made me it makes me look like I'm naked from far away because <laughs> it's the same same color as my skin tone most of the time. It it, it just looks weird. <laughs> so I usually got with like black cargo pants and I liked them. I didn't I stopped wearing them after a bit. I got a new pair. But yeah. Na -na -na. Oh, stop it, please. What what's going on? I don't know. Yes. They're very comfortable, too. They're just super comfortable. I never really like leggings, because um, I wear leggings a lot, but I don't like wearing them out very much, because I just feel exposed. But, um... Cargo pants? Love them. Of course, you still have fire hair because fun but uh that's that's definitely an outfit i like that one it's nice looking okay let's go with an alternate outfit <laughs> okay we still have another half hour so let's look for another outfit hmm what style of outfit should we do? Should we go with the same sort of aesthetic or should we go with something else? Hmm. Go with this, like a very oversized jacket or something? I don't know. Hmm. <laughs> you like wearing oversized jackets. And then having like a skirt underneath is, a bit, is always very fun. Good idea. Oversized jackets. So if it was oversized, sure, like the jacket would go like down here or something. Hmm. Nope. Ah! I keep pressing but buttons and then stuff happens and I don't know what they do. <laughs> Good. Okay. And then. Well. How are oversized things so hard to to draw? There we go. Good enough, they also. Yeah, it's fine. And then the socks. Big socks. And then uh, go with like boots or something again, because I like boots. Boots boots go with everything. Besides dresses or something. And even then, depends on the dress. Go with like big 
Chunky socks. Chunky socks. Cat socks? <laughs> Have you ever watched like Aphmau and stuff? Little cat socks. I wanted cat socks for so long when I was watching Aphmau stuff. I wish she, she still did the role plays and stuff because they were fun to watch every like Sunday. And plus the fact that, you know, it kind of did not. That's why it's going like that. Okay. They kind of left the freaking mice tree in like a big old cliffhanger of like Aaron not being able to like remember Afmo and stuff. And it's. Why? <laughs> why end us there and then go into like preschool content? Why? Hmm? Miss Circle. Hmm. What is in this circle? Hmm. Oh, those type of dresses. You know what? That is a very good fit. Hmm. I like them. Good suggestion. Mm -hmm. Very good to su suggestion, actually. <laughs> Pen mode, and it keeps <laughs> it keeps going to black or white. God dang it! Stop pressing buttons and just erase, please. You know what? Actually, just do this. Don't. You can just do this. Remove layer. Add layer. There we go. No more problem. <laughs> now go back over to there. Go to black. Okay. <laughs> Suggestions, very good suggestions. Okay, I do like that one. Mm -hmm. Images. There we go. That's better. Well, this one's pretty, though. I'm trying to find one with, like, a good silhouette to it. Mm -mm. Good silhouette, good silhouette. That looks pretty. Okay. Da, da, da. This one's very pretty, actually. This one is like those little bell sleeves. Pretty cute. Um, also, we're gonna add some suggestions, yeah? Some things. Mm -hmm. I usually do that culture dots, so I'm gonna try to do on that. No, we're gonna go. Actually, we're gonna go like this. Move that over. 
I'm learning the tools slowly but surely. There we go. And then deselect is this button. Yes. Yay! I remembered the buttons. Yay. We're slowly getting into it. And then... I do like the gloves. Well, ah! Come on. Hmm. Now this is the dilemma. Do I go with the corset or do I go with the cutouts? Hmm. Cutouts, corset. Cutouts, corset y looking look. Okay, but like, how are you fitting in that dress? There's a model here that I'm looking at, and I don't understand how she's still in the dress. Like, it looks like it'd fall off at any moment. Like, you don't want a freaking picture of you falling out of that thing. That is so low. Okay, anyways. Ooh, this one's pretty. Ooh, this one's actually really pretty, though. Okay, wait. <laughs> go with this. Wait. Um, there I go. God. That's why I like having a dedicated brush for the freaking eraser tool. Because I keep having to make the size bigger or smaller. Okay. She's really pretty though. <laughs> so she has a corsetti looking thing, right? Hmm. Uh there we go. Mm. And then she has like this sash thing that comes down to here, and then it kind of goes up into that area. Mm hmm. And then, let's see. And there's like a corset type of thing. The hourglass corset thing. Going on. Okay, what is... Ah, that's great. Okay, there we go. And then there's just a circle-y thing, and then on the sides, kind of go down the leg. Uh, and then there's the inter part. Mm -hmm. And there's feeding. Oh, it, it. I'm zooming way too far out. Okay, there we go. Ooh. Wonder if I. Uh... I always like the high low like um things. I feel like it should be higher than that actually. I think it'd be more grande. Like the just got to really flow out. And then she also has gloves, so we're gonna add those gloves. And of course, I always do the gloves with the, uh, the cutout. 
And then there's like lace and stuff in there. <laughs> yes, pretend that is lace. That is completely lace stuff and it's not scribbles. <laughs> there are people who can draw lace. I don't understand it. Uh, okay, let's do something here. Okay. Go with the, a darker black, but like a bit more of a gray side. Okay, and then. Oh, this. And then there's that. And there's that. Yeah, legs. Actually, when it comes to legs, um, I did find like a little cheat sheet to do for that. Actually, now that I think about it, <laughs> for legs, I just kind of do. Let's see if I can remember it. That it has like a sort of pattern to it, like that type of thing. Where um, when it comes to like the thigh area, like this area, it has like a straight side, like straighter side. And then a more curved side. And then when it comes to the calf area, you just kind of make a curved and then a straight again. And there we go. And when you, and then you have to remember that the joint is here. So when you go to, mm, you know, make it, you know, curved or like not curved, <laughs> bend, you still have that same sort of joint. Mm, it's just a little thing that I kind of figured out how to do. Though, for me, the feet are always the hardest thing to do. Like, these feet. These feet took way too freaking long to figure out how to do. I don't even know how I did it. <laughs> and this one kind of still looks kind of weird to me. But, I did it. Woo. And then with, like, hips and stuff, it's just kind of... I usually start out with, like, a box. And then... Ooh, box. Box. Hello. There we go. And then you kind of just go around it. <laughs> yeah. It's weird, isn't it? <laughs> You'd expect because, like, thigh stuff is usually, like, you know, thighs are round. Calves are kind of straight. with the, Because, um, at least here, there's usually like, a, a bone that's, like, right at the edge here. So, like, usually this start, start <laughs> this part of the, um, of the thing. Yeah, honestly, when I first draw these, they're not that good. <laughs> this took, like, 17 different sketches going over and over and over each other until it finally gets there. And don't ever try to, to get me to draw heels, because this is the type of heel I can draw. That's it. <laughs> Which is dumb, because I have a character in my comic that has, like, heels, and it just, it, 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 this doesn't look good. <laughs> uh, yeah, but, yeah, but when it comes to legs... Usually here is where the bone is, and so this part is usually very straight. Because, like, if you, if you feel your leg, you can kind of feel the bone there. Um, and then... Here is just kind of... This part is more straighter than over here, but it's still kind of curved. <laughs> but yeah, and then just remember the, where the knee is, and there you go. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, when it comes to art stuff, I usually just kind of make it into, like, as easy for my brain as possible to understand. Because <laughs> just looking at a reference of a person can be so freaking, like, intimidating. Because, you know, people are we weirdly proportioned and whatever. People are weird. <laughs> and so trying to, like, figure out how to do things is dumb. <laughs> and... I feel like I do, I do that with like a lot of the things on people. Like for head is just you know the circle and then the oops circle and then you kind of make a line. You kind of do that type of thing. <laughs> ah, come on. 
I hate using this brush for like sketching stuff. <laughs> so, circle. I can't make a circle for the life of me. And then you can go up there. It depends on which type of character. If it's more masculine looking, usually the this little point of like the jaw is more pointier. And then you have a straighter edge on the side. Usually I kind of just kind of make the general shape of it and then just use liquify to make it look better. Um, yeah, there you go. And then when it comes to women, you have the same sort of angle to the jaw, but it's a lot more rounder and softer edge to it. At least for me, I have a very round face. So for me, it's just round all the way. <laughs> yeah. There we go. <laughs> The amount of times I have to press that stupid button. Okay. Now, hands? Hands? I usually just go with, like, making this shape and then making this, that shape until you have the hand. And then, um, usually for hands, this is something I kind of just, like, figured out on my own. Unless you're making a very specific hand movement. Most fingers have, like, three joints in the hand. You know, you have, like, this little joint, and then this little joint, and this is knuckle. But when it comes to drawing stuff, to make it easier, because nobody will ever notice, just make it two joints. <laughs> <laughs> nobody will know the difference. Because, you know, most people don't kind of do this with their hand. So if you just make it more simpler and just kind of boop, it's fine. <laughs> make two joints. And then another thing, I just kind of tied fingers behind each other. So like here, instead of drawing the full hand, I just kind of overlapped them. <laughs> Not that this is supposed to be looking like a real hand or anything, it's just a... <laughs> Very weird looking hand, but it, it's a hand, kind of. <laughs> Supposed to be doing stuff. Yes. Okay. Ooh. Nope. Let's make that one bigger. You know what? I just realized something. Four. Whenever I get, like, called away for whatever, I can just do this one effect. Let's see if I can make it happen. Because I was trying to figure out how to do it. Because it's a very specific effect. Um, to me. So, it might be a little loud. So, uh, loudness warning in a second. <laughs> uh, it should be... That one? No. This? There we go. I could use that. For a be right, be right back screen. I feel like it fits. <laughs> and it's supposed to make noise. I don't know if it is, though. <laughs> I had a lot of extra time yesterday. <laughs> you can tell. I made... Oop. I made things. And then... What's the other one? This one. This one. And of course, the one I just saw. So, I had a lot of extra time to make stupid effects. <laughs> oh, there is a screen. Nope, oh, don't want that. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, really? There's no noise to it? God oh, dang it. That's weird. Oh, wait. I think I know where it's supposed to be at. Wait, 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 wait. Eh? Eh? I think it's this. There was a bit of audio there. <laughs> okay, I think it's here. One sec. I think I accidentally muted it. So, three, two, one. Did it make a noise? I feel like I didn't hear a noise. Let's see. Which is connected. Yada, 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 yada. Okay. Headphones connected, disconnected. Let's see if that works. 
Nope. I don't hear anything. God dang it. Supposed to make a noise. No. Okay, whatever. <laughs> nope. Wrong way. There we go. Let's make that go over there. God dang it. Huh. These things are weird. It's very weird. Because yesterday it was working. That's stupid weird to happen. Okay, whatever. I'll probably fix it later on. It's fine. Hmm. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Do, 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 do. We got our handbag. Okay. I have to remember I have buttons. Da, 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 da. God dang it! There, nope. <laughs> That's great. It keeps going to white, even though it's not. Everything. <laughs> ah, God dang it! Okay, wait. There we go. Just gonna make this a lot bigger. There we go. It's good enough. <laughs> I could always like add this look to it. Didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Redo. Thank you. Okay. I always liked like dresses with slits. I don't know what it is. It's very aesthetically pleasing. <laughs> there you go. And I will always go back to the purple. I will always add the purple. There we go. No, that's not the right of the purple. It's more bluer. Dad. Hmm. Pop out. Ooh, purple. <laughs> I don't like this dress. I feel like I would actually have this dress in real life. <laughs> it's a really nice looking dress, Daddy. Even though it's very sketchy at the moment, but it's fine. It's fine. Mm -hmm. Is there any other, like, specifically, like, you know, Thought related questions you may have because I might not have all the answers, but I may have a answer. <laughs> Let's make this like a lighter gray black area and then use a different layer and then add this in. Boop, 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 boop. And then that's like this that's what I go down. And Leia skin type, which this is always a little bit harder to figure out. Yeah. Nope, that's a bit too orangey. That's good enough. It's a bit too brown, but fine for now. Do -do -do -do. No, 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 no. Um, basic outline done. Woo! Woo woo! Okay, there. <laughs> Cut. 
to make this a bit more. Hmm. Where is the skateboard? Here's down there. Okay, I'm gonna put this up here then. Or not, apparently. Okay, whatever. <laughs> Make sure I one little thing here. Let's see. Boop. <laughs> it always have like a little silver trim to it. Mm, something to make it more fantastical. Or something, I don't know what the word would be. No, stop, stop it, stop it, stop it. Ah, got it. Okay. Go with this. Over to here. There we go. And that. That's all right. There we go. Mm, yeah, we'll just take those out, whatever. Yeah, it's fine. Anyway. <laughs> so I think these were all no, we don't want. Is it shift? Might be shift. Yes it is, okay.
My mom sneaked into my room. Anyways. <laughs> well, thank you. It's not that fabulous, but uh, I definitely... There we go. There we go. Without the color. Okay. This color is fine. Yeah, there you go. This color is fine. <laughs> um... Hello, Shoto. Don't do that. Don't, don't. Mm. No. Mm hmm. Okay, there we go. My, what? No, I feel that it is already been 30 minutes. Okay. I never know how to end these things, honestly. They always seem so awkward to end things. I wish I could just be like, bye. <laughs> just, yeah. Wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Da, 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 da. Just be like, bye. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. But hello. I'm very close to you now. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah. I knew. Do you have to go? So that's going to be it for today. Um, next week is going to be more of um, usual gaming stuff. Uh, whatever. I'm going to try getting like a specifically a drawing video out like at some point next week. But I'm still big. I forgot. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, <laughs> but yeah. Next week I'm possibly going to get video. Yeah. Video. I also have to do a couple other things. God dang it. <laughs> But for tomorrow, doing that, um, yeah, I think that's everything. I'm gonna try doing more stuff with the model art to see if I can actually do it now because I have like the actual computer program, so it won't be as pixely as the other ones because I did on Procreate. Procreate has a big problem with like pixelation stuff because you know, small tablet, anyways. But that is for it for today, so yeah, I maybe got a handle on the new tablet and the. And the, the, the Krita thing, because it's, it, it's complicated. Anyway, there's so many buttons. There's so many buttons. <laughs> but yeah. So, video next week. Um, probably, most likely, going to stream next week as well. Um, I've been playing uh, the Batman Arkham Knight game, because I love Batman. Um, especially the Robins, specifically like Jason Todd. But regardless, he's not in... Well, he's technically in the game. <laughs> um, but anyways. So next week's video... And stream thing. Woo. <laughs> um, hopefully this time we won't die a billion times by the end of the stream. The stream was supposed to end, like, I, I think, like, 20 minutes earlier than it did because I kept dying on the last fight I was going to do. It was so annoying. It's great. It was perfect. <laughs> but, yeah. Anyways. Bye-bye <laughs> for now. Bye. Okay.